Hi everyone. How are we all doing? Um, I myself am a little bit ill, <laughs> so um, I do sound a little bit nasally. Oh, Nariel, hi. Nice to have you. Did not expect you here. Um, yeah, I myself am a little bit nasally. I I am a little bit ill. Don't know what it is. Um, so I do apologise if I have to blow my nose a lot of stuff. But I'm still here, I made it, and I'm excited because I, I went overboard, I went to game yesterday and I purchased a fucking uh, elite trainer box when I already have two of these elite trainer boxes. <laughs> um, so, yeah, um, I don't know, I'll, I'll be alright, right? There's ten um, Pokemon cards in there, so... Yeah, I'm sure we'll all enjoy that. <laughs> um, okay, so uh, I'm gonna start my shield progress. The shield, yeah, I'm gonna shield. Um, stretch and H2O. Okay, and let me see, where's my water? I've lost my water. Oh. Right, I think you'll give me my water for a bit. Outfit reveal. I am here, I am here, I promise. Uh, this is the outfit for the day. I was gonna wear my pajamas, but I uh, then decided against it because I um the t-shirt I wanted to uh, wear with the joggers. No, well yeah, jammy jo Jimmy jammy joggers was uh, in the wash, so I was like, all right, second next most comfortable thing is a dress. <laughs> so um yeah yeah um okay so. Um, so, sorry, I was just making sure that I've turned thingies on. Um, alright, I'm also going to be eating a little bit, because I, I, I could either stream now or in the next half an hour if I ate, and I was like, I'm just going to stream now, because at the beginning of every game, you always have to, like, choose uh, things and watch, like, cutscenes and stuff, so we'll just... We'll just make our way through it. Um, but yeah, uh, Nariel, what have you been up to? We're healthy here. Um, what does that mean? <laughs> like, you're healthy. I, I hope that's what you mean. I hope you're healthy. I think I pressed the wrong button. Okay. Um, I'm really sorry. Nintendo consoles are a novelty in my eyes. Uh... Right, Nabu. It means we hydrated and stretched. <laughs> okay, that's that's yeah. I'm healthy now, guys. Um, sorry, I've got some soup. Mm. Forgot to mute it. Well, not mute it, but like turn it down. Welcome, one and all. Welcome to the wonderful world of Pokemon. Our beloved Galar region is a wonderful place with thriving nature, um, beautiful cities, and many Pokemon with which we share our lives. Um, as you know, our society is able to thrive. This fucking cute font is so beautiful. Thanks for the help from these mysterious creatures that we call Pokemon. You'd think that they spent so many years with them and tried to like understand where they came from. Um, and I've been coming in your world. I feel like that's all you have been doing in the past like month now, Nariel. But I am proud and happy that you have found something that you are enjoying. Uh, morning, Satoshi. How you doing? It's is the beginning of something good. <laughs> um, I mean, whenever you start a new Pokemon game, it is the beginning of something good, right? Uh, but yeah, uh, welcome. How are you today? What have you been up to? Tell me everything. Don't mind me, I'm just eating. Come on, it's only been a week long beta. Well, he keeps talking. <coughs> I died. 
This soup is really spicy and I had this issue yesterday. Um, it's only like, uh, I just want Ashes of Creation but access to Alpha is $500 plus tax. Well that's like 400 pounds isn't it? It's like a rent's worth of food, that's the spirit. Uh, that's right, uh, alright so. And those of us who choose and raise, sorry, to raise and train Pokemon to do battle and compete, we call Pokemon Trainers. This game's graphics is actually pretty nice. Like, beside, aside from the fact that it's obviously in a tone art style, I think it's done very well. Um, sorry, that sounded like I'm having a complaint of the art style. I'm not, I, I look like weird. TV fucking heads. I just, I don't know. It's really late. It's really early. <laughs> really tired. Now, turn your geese, the Galar region's greatest Pokemon trainer, your undefeated champion. It's time for Champion Leon's exhibition match. <clears throat> Considering my PC is falling apart, like, really, I can't that. <laughs> That's fine. I understand. I am. Um, I've been calculating my life um, and like how much money it's like supposed to go out etc and for next month I've actually included how much money I am going to definitely spend on Pokemon cards and uh, man I'm, I'm not moving out anytime soon I'm telling you this much <laughs> this this year is just oh my god oh I forgot that's Cool stuff, cool stuff. Ah, <gasps> my favorite Pokemon. I fucking love Wooloo. <laughs> All right, well, he didn't lose on screen anyway. <laughs> oh, it's me, <laughs> little Nebu. Hello, hello! Oh, that was your- that your- wait. Oh, that your flash new phone, Nebu. So, why was that so difficult to read? Uh, were you watching Lee's exhibition match on it, but you can't cheer him on with your hands full? Uh, you know the only way to properly cheer on Lee would be with his famous Charizard pose. Please do it. Oh shit, my mum's cute. Look at her! Can I just say that, like, if a mum has a side ponytail, to me that is like an instant milf. Like, I, I hate to say this, but watching too many hentais and stuff has just, like, put this idea into my head. Um, didn't expect to see you here today, dear. Isn't this the big day? Yes. Uh, that's exactly why I came running over to get Nebu. Never mind watching the match now. I've got it recorded at home anyway. I recalled all my brother's matches. Come with me, Nebu. He should be here any minute. And Lee always brings presents when he visits, so I wouldn't forget that bag if I were you. Now I've got to run. See you at mine later. Did you just admit to watching to too many 2D porn movies? Um, yes, but like... I'm not ashamed of it. Everyone watches stuff that they like. And like, I hate to say this, but some head ties have like decent plots. Some don't. But it's fine. We still love them. 2D porn though. Yeah, but like they're all like Um I don't have to say this. Like it's just another series to watch for me. <laughs> Not up to date with Jojo at the moment, but I am on top of my hentai stack. Please don't hate me. I just have priorities, right? Oh shit, Benpa, what is this? Two month streak. Hey, Norman Human. Hi, Benpa, how you doing? Um, guess what? I noticed that you were streaming the other day. So I came in like 
three hours after you started the stream because like that's when I had like the lift no well that's when I saw the notification and you are no longer there you don't even stream for three hours no I'm joking but like I couldn't do my thing that I wanted to do and I just feel really bad um but yeah okay okay let's walk let's walk much lax leaves leftovers around its bed from time to time what's a much lax it's a fireplace that's built into the house it keeps things warm in the harshest winter that's a good power it's the television that mum uses to watch her comedy dramas mood there are lots of books and magazines about pokemon neatly lined up is this much lax i feel like this might be much lax Grzzr. Om gom. Thank <laughs> you. Right, you adorable thing. Let's carry on. Um, it's me mum. Let's speak to mum. Rushing off in that state, Nebush. Didn't Hop say you should bring your bag? I saw it last in your room. And don't forget to grab a hat for all the weather. Typical mum. <laughs> I'm here saying she's a top tier MILF. And she dares to tell me to wear a fucking hat. <laughs> uh, yeah, I streamed as I just got a webcam and tried it out while playing The Ascend. We'll be streaming tonight and or tomorrow too, I think. Okay, well, I will, like, do my hardest to be there for at least one of them and support you as much as I can. It might not be tonight because I am supposed to be going out drinking with work people as my leavers do. Um, so, yeah. <laughs> It'll be great fun. Uh, it's a brand new tally, your mum bought it so that you could use your game console. Sick. Look at this beautiful fucking Eevee plush. It's super soft to the touch. The latest video game console is sitting by the telly. Cute. It's a simple desk that you can keep using even when you become an adult. It's kind of neat. I have a Pikachu and an Eevee poster. What's in the wardrobe? No, you're not. No. Bed. It's the bed you went to buy as family. It's super comfy and puts you to sleep instantly. You grabbed your mum's old bag. Lovely. Um, so what are you streaming today then, Benpai? Adventure guide. Open the X menu by pressing the X button. Makes sense. You can save your progress by selecting save from the X menu. Also makes sense. You can also check your location and your next destination by selecting the town map. Right. Got a cool hat on. Let's see if my mum says anything. Oh, don't you look a treat. I knew that bag would suit you. Now hurry along. Hop is waiting, isn't he? But remember, no going into the forest for the two of you. Funny you should say that, Mum. I think we might be going into the forest. Right. Right, right, right. Right, right. Mm. Oh, super nice. I needed it. Oh, is that a waddle? No, it's not, is it? Is it a Sawaddle? I feel like it is. Please, someone tell me. <laughs> right, let's keep running. Oh, there's Hop. Ha ha ha, have a look at you, Nebu. That old bag looks like it could pull you over. At least we know that it should hold anything Lee might bring. Even if it's as big as Snorlax. Oh, Jesus. A Wooloo, but what's it doing here? Nah, sorry. Hey, you silly Wooloo. I see what you're up to. Don't go using tackle on the fencing. Now you listen. No going past that fence, no. Everyone knows there are scary Pokemon living in this slumbering world. Nah. I'm sure you're all here for me doing this. Now that's taken care of. How about it, Nebu? Let's race. I bet I can make it to my house first. What with you lugging about that big old bag? Wooloo, please don't do this. I bet that Wooloo is gonna go through. Hop just left it. Can I do anything with it? Can I stop this? No, no interaction with the sheep whatsoever. I oh, okay. 
Oh, okay, I can interact a little with these ones. What's this guy saying? The power of science is amazing. Now you can battle and train Pokemon with other people just by walking around. Isn't that super amazing? Okay. I assume we're supposed to go here. That's Hop's mum. That sounds like me. <laughs> Mum, is he here? There you are at last, Hop. Oh, and you've brought along Nebu. Hello, dear. Yeah, yeah, but where's Lee? Have you got him crammed and covered? He's still not here yet for the hundredth time. Honestly, Hop, you must learn some patience. He's probably only just arrived at the station in Wedgehurst. Then that's where I'm going. You know, Lee is hopeless with directions. I'll make sure he doesn't get lost on the way. Oh, will you? Yeah, that's probably is for the best. Imagine being a Pokemon League champion and not knowing directions that'd be me i'm terrible with directions even google maps can't help me sometimes startup sail down me is i feel like i should understand but i don't hello there aloy how are you today Explain your sentence to me, because I am not very good at English. <sighs> You've got to come with Nebu. You've still not met my big bro, right? You can't miss out on your chance to meet the undefeated champion. I'll wait for you out on the route. route. <gasps> it's a purloin! What a kiwi. Oh shit. Is this a dilf? Are we seeing a dilf? To hop. His brother is a superhero. Cute. Alright. Um. I think I can just let you put it up. No, I can't just leave. Um, I went through here. Hmm, took me a while to figure it out. Okay, let's keep running. Let's get a move on. Only remember, every wild Pokemon can come out of nowhere if you walk through patches of tall grass. I've got my Wooly with me, so I'm ready for battles against wild Pokemon, but not you. So we'll stay clear of the tall grass as we go. If you don't pick Sobble, you're wrong. <laughs> I don't know, Sobble's a little crybaby. We're gonna talk. Let's go and meet Lee at the station that's dead ahead from here. How you doing, Emma? How has life been treating you on this beautiful Saturday morning? But he's so cute! He's pretty cute. He is pretty cute. I will give you that. <laughs> cute smile. Leon is kind of cute. I'll give him that. And Charizard's like tiny. It's weird. Hello, hello Wedgehurst, your champion Leon is back. I promise I'll keep doing my best to deliver the greatest battles for you all to watch. It's an unbeatable champion Leon. You and Charizard are the greatest. Well, thank you for that. I hope you lol um, carry on training up your Pokemon and never shy from battle. Then come challenge me for the champion title. Where are they? We've all been working on our battle skills just like you've taught us to, Leo. Um, I'm alright, thanks. Just had to reorder new headphones. My resin face and demons are currently on the sofa covered in tape. I feel for you. My, um. I, um. Uh, yeah, Charizard is an absolute giant in the anime, but he's only like 5'4. Yeah, it's how, how I remember Charizard, like, bigger stuff. Um, been re watching Indigo League the other. Well, started it, like. A while ago now but I'm really slow because I'm doing it with my boyfriend uh, and we don't see each other often uh, and even when we do I forget to put on the TV because I'm a special cupcake 
because uh, all we do is just Pokemon Go at the moment, because, you know, it's 2021, what else could I be doing if it's not Pokemon Go in? Uh, Pixabble, Lone Wolf, thank you for the bitty titties. Um, I don't know if that's enough to uh, <laughs> to convince me to pick a little crying baby, but I'll see. I'll see what's the cutest. Uh, that's why I want the strongest of challenges to fill the gym challenge and come battle. <laughs> My wish is for Galar trainers to work together to become the strongest in all the world. Rowing, Steve. <laughs> Lee! Pop! Cute. So my number one fan in all the world has come out of his way to pick me up. Look at you, Hop. I reckon you've grown exactly an inch and a quarter since the last time I saw you. Bingo, that's the sort of sharp eye that's kept you undefeated so long, A. Hey, Lee. And these bright eyes over here, I've got it, you must be Nebu, am I right? I've heard loads about you from my little brother. I'm the Galar region's greatest ever Pokemon champion and a massive Charizard fan too. People call me the unbeatable Leon. I think he's trying to show off. Do you reckon he likes me? Imagine if you could date people in Pokemon. Oh shit, thank you for the follow, that's so lovely. Um. I feel like I remember you from, from Well Lone Wolf. Did we play like Monster Hunter together? Um, also Emma, what headset are you getting? Alright. Always oh, wanted to be the best, doesn't he? With a proper rival of his own, I bet he'd push himself to become something truly special. Logitech G700 30 frames. Okay. Not a bad choice. Uh, I mean, I did play Monster Hunter. I, f I feel like that's how I remember you, Lone Wolf. I remember you from Monster Hunter. Um, but how are you today? Thank you so much for the bitties. It means the world to me. Um, that's getting a little too a big number. <laughs> little by little. Uh, I'll always be around to make sure everyone in Galar can have a champion time. Come on. Okay. Um, hmm. I, um, I'm not a headset person because I get headaches if I have stuff over my ears for too long. So, um... I'm fine with earphones, but then obviously for gaming. And to be fair, I've got a um, noise gate set up so I can negate anything coming out of my speakers so I no longer have to wear headsets. Uh, but I do have a pair of um, Razor's keys, uh, obviously because I'm a white girl um, and they are adorable. But I have the wireless ones that are better for your phone than they are for actual like, gaming. Um, oh. Yeah, that's that's all I use to be fair. Uh, you brought Nebu and me Pokemon. No, you did, didn't you? Oh no, you must have. Right then, the greatest gift from the greatest champion. It's showtime, everyone. Take a good look, you two. <laughs> Grokey is fucking adorable. <laughs> oh, look at him just trying to. Oh, my God. Um, that's my first hairset I ever bought used to kill my head, honestly. I can't remember what they were, but they were pretty heavy in comparison to the Diva headset. Well, the Bluetooth ones are lighter than the... Sorry, I don't know why I keep picking them up. Um, the Bluetooth ones are lighter than the original Kitty headset, I think. <coughs> I think. I'm saying I think. I think it's not. I don't remember. 
Um, I did have the original Kitty headset for a bit uh, when I started streaming, uh, just because obviously it's nice for stream in my opinion, and they're dead cute. Um, but unfortunately, I had to return it because it had like intermittent issues where it would like unplug itself a lot on its own. Um, so there's something wrong with the cable, so I had to return it. And then they got the boot for it, and then I was like, "This is not for video gaming. This is for like." Um, uh, I don't know English. It's not for gaming, it's more suited for a phone use. And I was like really fed up with it because it's like just spent money on something that I evidently didn't research, so it's my fault. But I, I just didn't expect to get so bamboozled. You can only change the color if you have it connected to the phone, you can't connect it to the um, Razer's desktop app. So yeah, <laughs> it is time, that's right, it is time, I need to stop postponing the inevitable. Go on, you pick first. I've already got my Wooloo after all. That's so kind of you, Hop. Oh, look at them all beautifully lined up. Okay, so... Score bunny is fire type, it's filled to bursting with fiery passion. You set on the fire type, Score bunny. Alright, I'm going to... Have a look at all of them up close, and I'm gonna choose. Oh, the grass type Pokemon Grookey. A, it's even like a nice long walk in the woods. M fucking, it's final Evo. Rillaboon is anything but a even long walk in the woods. Um, but I am not sat on that one either. Let's look at some more. Oh. That's the water type Sobble. It adapts to anything as surely as water flows. Um. Well, um. Let me eat. <laughs> let me eat whilst I think. So. I like Grookey. Could always start a poll, maybe. I want to make, like, a decision myself for the first time in my life. <laughs> I'm really bad at making decisions, and you can evidently see that, but, um... I think it's time. I think it's time I man up. Um... And I don't know. Um, okay. 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 Let's let's go, Skull Buddy. He's the cutest. Yes. You chose Scarbony! Would you like to give Scarbony a nickname? Anyone want to nickname my Scarbony? <laughs> Whilst I sort my nose out. Where's my tissue? Um. I'm gonna do everyone a big solid favour and I'm gonna do this off. And also my mic for a second. Flair is a lovely name. I can I can get down for Flair. <laughs> um, let me just find the camera thing. <laughs> there we go. Um, Flair sounds good. It's cute. Um, I took that. There we go. Flair has been added to your party. Thank you so much for that, uh, Lone Wolf. I appreciate you. Um, 
Appreciate the bitty titties as well. Bitty titty titties are important. And guess what, guys? I have a starter thing on my side now. <laughs> I also have a skull bunny plushie because I actually think skull bunny is bloody adorable. Uh, so we'll have him with me for a bit whilst I figure out how to play this game properly. Um. Do, do, do. Ah! <laughs> That's cute. Oh, this game breaks me. I have a Mimikyu plush. Oh, I'm so jealous. I would love a Mimikyu plush. I want all the Pokemons as plushies. Um, but the ones I'm kind of dying for right now are uh, Galarian Ponyta, which you can only get in the Pokemon Center. Um, and I really want a Ampharos one. They're so cute. Oh, I love Ampharos. <laughs> um, so it'll be Scorbunny 4, you nice one. Then I'll go with Grookey. You're mine. I'm aiming to be the next champion, so be ready and I'll be doing some serious training. <laughs> Cutie pies. Possible! <laughs> And you'll come with me. Charizard will show you the ropes. He's strict but real strong and real kind too. Oh! God bless Subble. Dinner's ready, children. Bring along your Pokemon and let's all eat. Don't worry, Leon uses him. This is cute. This is really cute. The next day. You spend the whole night with that new partner of yours, right Hop? You two get on all night. All right, sorry. Understanding one another. Maybe even built up a bit of love. Cause I have Lee. Nebu's made fast friends with a score bunny too. Then listen up, new trainers. Believe in yourself and your Pokemon. If you trust in one another and carry on battling side by side long enough, then someday. You might even become worthy rivals for me, the unbeatable champion. What you're looking at her for, Lee, I'm the one who'll be coming to challenge you. If you think Nebu might be able to challenge you, then I guess she's my first rival. But I'm not planning to lose to her and miss out my chance to be the unbeatable champion. Just having a Pokemon with you doesn't make you a real trainer, you know. Alright, Jesus Harp. Proper trainers raise the Pokemon up to be first rate in battle too. Oh, and you think you're worthy of calling yourself such a proper trainer already, Hop? Guess I'll be the judge of that. Let's see how you handle yourself in a battle against your friend if she's up for it. What'd you say? Well, and then ready to take Hop in the first ever Pokemon battle of your life? Hell yeah. Leave in your partner Pokemon and care for them too with all your heart. Do those two things and I'm certain you'll learn to choose the moves that suit your Pokemon and more importantly to have a champion time battling with them. This is cute. Looks like everyone's on board, Pokemon and trainers alive, then let's do this. That's my first fight guys. I've watched every match that Lee's ever had, I've read every book and magazine he left behind at home too and exactly what to do in order to win. That's fantastic but... Isn't grass weak to fire? <laughs> oh, he sent out Wooly. That's cheeky. I'm not gonna lie, Nintendo is absolutely no right in making the original soundtrack fucking slap so hard. I feel like a lot of Pokemon uh, soundtracks were incredible. Um, 
Because the Let's Go Eevee one, that's obviously a remake of the originals, um, is amazing. Um, and I remember playing X, and I fucking love that. It's not over yet, I've added another trusty ally to my team. Pokemon Trainer Hop sent out a Grookey. Right, let's use Ember on that little shit. Did you already know about type advantages? Sorry, Grookey. Hop is cheating, he has experience. It's fine. We steal his experience, right? That's right. We stole it. You defeated Pokemon Trainer Heart. You beat my two Pokemon with your one? You and that Scarbony are too much. I feel like he's really butthurt. Even though his Wooly was like underleveled compared to my um, Scobany. And his Grookey is evidently weak against my Scobany. So, um, yeah, what's about that, yo? Right, um, let's, let's just, let's just, let's just carry on. I'm, I'm not going to cry about this. Okay. X and Y was great. I think out of the newer games, I absolutely love some of them. It's very dialogue happy, but it's got my boy Guzma in it, so. Uh, here's a fun fact. I only got a 3DS when I was 19. That was my first ever Nintendo console before you start shit at me. Um, and I have literally only played X because I finished playing Fire Emblem Conquest. Was it Conquest? I'm trying to think. Um, and I needed something to play before my Fire Emblem Echoes um, fuck, Shadows of Valencia came and I was like, okay, I'll just play Pokemon. And I really enjoyed it, but my primary reason as to why I got the 3DS was to play through all the Fire Emblem titles on DS and 3DS. So that's kind of what I focused on, and uh, I've not played anything else. <laughs> not even a Hello Kitty game, even though it was really intriguing. Um, so yeah, so X and Let's Go Eevee are my only two Pokemon games that I have played. Jess, hello, sweet pea, how are you? Are you working today? Oh, it's so lovely to see you, but I want to see you IRL sometime. We should hang out soon. Um, honestly, get Sun Moon on the Ultra version, they're so good. I think they're pretty cheap compared to the other Pokemon games. I don't have a 3DS at the moment, but I did ask uh, Flupty if he is willing to see if he still has his, um, so that I can borrow it and play through Fire Emblem, but also Pokemon. <laughs> um, yeah, sorry. Um, yes, I am. Oh, that excites me. Like, mad. Um, wait, what have you been up to lately? Tell me everything. Tell me everything. <gasps> oh shit, uh, Pokemon Booster Pack opening. Okay, y'all are in for a treat today. Um, yesterday, I was like, today's a big day because today I'm doing a full day stream again. Um, and I will be, um, I forgot. English is really not my thing, is it? Oh, and I was like, oh, I need to, um, I need to treat y'all. So I got a fucking elite trainer box. Even though I already have two of this particular one, I have decided to get a third one. Um, reason being is that unfortunately game did not have anything else. I couldn't get like two, um, I couldn't get two tins with things, like it was either this or I could get like a big box of like Crowback and someone else and I was just there uh, like, now nah, I'll just take the um, Ali Boost box. But it's fine, I got a discount on it because everyone in game loves me. Right, that's how it works. They love you and you get a discount. <laughs> um, I'm having a party in the month. Wait, 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 wait. Oh wait, oh that's cool. What party? Is it? Is it your birthday? 
Or is it just like a get together because no one's like been doing anything because of COVID? Um, yeah, yeah, I think Sword and Shield are a bit of a price, but meh. Um, I got them cheaper because I got them from someone. Oh, my best friend wanted to sell them to CX, and I was like, well, she wanted to sell both, but I only wanted one, so I was like, oh, can I buy one off you for like the price that you get for it? And she was like, yeah, whatever. It didn't bother me. I was like, yeah, yeah. Um, so you, in the Elite um, Trainer box, you get this beautiful box that collapses into one like this, basically. Um, you get a little player's guide that also has literally all the cards in here, and I'm going to show you which two cards in particular I am after in this fucking set, uh, so that y'all can pray for me, because they are incredibly hard to get. Um, oh shit, there's a shiny score bunny. Never mind, guys, there are free cards I want. Uh, <clears throat> so, um, there we go. There is the Galarian Ponyta shiny holographic that I am really wanting. And then you obviously have the Galarian Rapidash also shiny holographic. So, those are my two cards that I don't have from the set that I really want. Um, and that's why I went for this and not Chilling Rain. I feel like I'm more likely to get Shinies than I am to get um, anything from Chilling Rain. Um, so, talking a lot again, aren't I? <laughs> Alright, let me slowly but surely go through all of this shit. Um, you get a bit of cardboard. Nintendo always likes to be extra. Um, love to give you a load of cardboard. So in this you also get Eevee Sleevies, I fucking love saying Eevee Sleevies so you will hear that a lot, uh, I'm a child aren't I, yeah, I get a little code, but I also get a um, promo card, an Eevee VMAX promo card, um, a really nice promo card, they're not worth a lot because they come with every trainer box, but pretty cute. Um, and then this is one of the rare times where you actually get uh, 10, not 8 booster packs. Um, so, uh, yeah, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So I have 10 in here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to shuffle these so they are in no particular order, just in case people can tell what will be in my box, um, depending on where the heck I pull it out from. Uh, if you get a Galarian Ponyta, I will actually scream, it is so pretty. I know, I love it. I don't know if you play Pogo, but uh, there was a Pokemon festival recently, um, and um, I took a day off for it, of course, because um, I wanted to to do stuff on it. Uh, and day one was like with like uh, a lot of Pokemons that I would not have seen because I only started playing like two weeks before that. Um, and then I was like, cool, cool, cool. And then I found out that you can actually get a Galarian Ponyta from it. It does not evolve, however. What's that? I lost my phone. I was gonna show you. But I don't think I can anymore. Um, oh, cool. if someone knows my number, can they call me so I can find my phone today? It'll be a pleasure. A pleasure? Uh, it'll be appreciated. H2, oh sorry, let me just put the soup away and let me have a drink. Okay, so. Um, wish me luck. <laughs> I don't actually play Pogo back when it came out. I had a crappy tariff of 1 gigabyte there, so I can play a much, plus it would drain my battery quickly. It does drain your battery quickly. That will be forever a thing that is not good for because it constantly uses your GPS data, internet data, and you're also like encouraged to use your camera a lot uh, here and there. So yeah, it's not good for your phone battery. Um, I definitely can confirm that. Sorry, I'm trying to see if I can not show everyone the top card so people don't know if I get anything good from this. <laughs> um, okay, so one, two, three from the top goes to the bottom, right? And then the top one should be, yeah, it's an energy card that we discard. It's the max mofo way. Um, okay, so our first one is a Cramorant. I have about 700 of these because Shine and Face was a very good set, so I actually got a lot of these. <laughs> um, then we have a, a Rusted Shield. 
I think this was actually a decent card to play, but I don't play anymore. So, well, I don't play this. Why did I say anymore? Making it sound like I ever played. I don't play cards uh, yet. I will. I will want to get into it when I finally sort my life out. Uh, team Yell Towel. Trainer card. Um, and then we have this beautiful Shinx. I really like this art. I think it's really well done. Um, definitely a card that you'd want to have as a holographic if it exists. Or at least a reverse so you can keep it somewhere nice. Um, then we... Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! <laughs> Not that Xena! Hi! How are you? Oh my god, I was just in the middle of opening a Pokemon card. Uh, boost the back. I'm gonna keep these two aside and I'm gonna do a little introduction. Um, hello everyone, how are you doing? Uh, it's so lovely to see you. Um, what was you- sorry, I'm gonna give you a quick shout out, but what have you been playing? Tell me everything. What brings you to my beautiful uh, channel? Um, not that Xena. Oh my god, I can't spell. I think that should work. Oh, he's used on the other one. Uh, so yeah, um, I am a little small time streamer. I'm getting there. Um, I am currently no life in Pokemon. Uh, that's kind of all I care about at the moment. Um, so I've started playing Pokemon Shield approximately 47 minutes ago. Um, and I have been enjoying it so far. I haven't really gotten far because I do talk a lot. <laughs> um, but I finished Let's Go Eevee on Wednesday. Uh, I got my Mewtwo in it as well and that was kind of like it for Let's Go Eevee for me. Um, and now I've moved on. We're progressing. Hopefully I will finish uh, Shield before I get the uh, Diamond and Pearl remasters. Um, but yeah, <laughs> uh, we've been doing some Pokemon Sword and Shield, wanted to pass on the right to someone doing their first playthrough. Oh, that's so lovely, as we just finished the main game, that's amazing! How long did it take you to finish the game itself? Um, and I saw you had a Skull Bunny plushie and I couldn't resist sending the right away. <laughs> well, um, it's only fair I have a Skull Bunny plushie if I choose Skull Bunny as my first um, Pokemon, right? I think that that's only fair. <laughs> so how do you find the game? Was you playing through shield or sword? Um, and why did you pick the one that you picked? Um, but yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna carry on. Uh, so we've got the little Nicket here. That's our next card. Um, <laughs> I'm, I'm like flustered now. Um, so we've got a Rowlet. Rowlet, I never know how to pronounce him. Also, a very nice art. A lot of these do have some nice details. Um, and I'm always like amazed by them a little bit. <laughs> so we've got a Trapinch. Uh, actually, a cute art here. Don't really understand Trapinch that much, but it's kind of cute. I'll give him that. Um, I'm doing sword. Picked it because I have a bad habit of whipping my sword out during other games like Statue Valley. <laughs> when I shouldn't. Uh, which one are you doing? Sword or shield? I am doing shield. I was going to do sword because they have the gothic Pokemon in it, but then unfortunately my love for Galarian Ponyta has grown a little bit too far. Uh, so I'm doing uh, shield purely for the Galarian Ponyta. <laughs> <laughs> Please don't hate me. Uh, thank you so much for the follow, Zena. I really appreciate that. I will give you a follow back, you know, because I will forget to, because I need to send love your way. Um, yeah, one second. Let me do it now. One second, one second. Follow. There we go. Okay. Um, sword because you mess up the doggo and you get the stab of Jesus Christ. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> uh, Galarian Ponyta is gorgeous to be fair, I don't blame you, thank you, I appreciate that. Okay, um, let's continue. So our next card is this beautiful Buizel. Um He's just chilling, looking to see if he can rescue anyone maybe? I don't know, I always try to tell a story from these, but I'm always wrong, so... <laughs> um, ooh! Oh, oh, this actually upsets me a little bit. So we actually do have a uh, reverse, no, not reverse, sorry, a holographic shiny card here. So this is a Dracovish. Um, if 
fuck. It's a good card to get. It's just I I was hoping for the Galarian Body Tower on the Rapid Ash. I'm a little bit like, oh. But I'm still happy because this is still a really good card, you know. Um, yeah, so the shiny holographic ones have the sparkles that the shiny cards have in this set. Really nice. Um, and then my last one is unfortunately just a Yan Mega. That's fine. We got a um, we got a good card here. Let me just sleeve it up before I get back onto the gameplay. You know the actual reason that's why I'm here. <laughs> um, so I will just give you a normal sleeve. I think. I don't think you deserve a proper sleeve. Maybe you do. To be fair, you know what? Let let me give you a nice sleeve. So, um, as it's my first playthrough, um, I, I like to, when it's like an important playthrough of something, I like to treat people to open in some of these packs on stream. I'm actually treating myself more than anyone. <laughs> but <laughs> there we go, a Dracovish. That's not a bad catch with my first. Um, let's, let's, let's play this game for a little bit and then um, I'll open some more when people redeem them. Um, okay, so, um, do, 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 there we go. Ooh, ooh sparkles, sparkles, sparkles. It, they're very pretty. I really do like all the, um, the shiny cards in the set. They are very cute. Uh, but anyway, okay, uh, well, that was a shock. Guess I now know why. Guess I know now why uh, Leaf thought he should give you a Pokemon too. You and your Pokemon all fought hard. Made me almost want to let out Charizard and join in on all the fun. <laughs> Imagine that! Like, you're just having a fight with, like, level 5 Pokemon and then, like, he's fucking Leon and there's Charizard and just very you all. Kind of show off what he's doing. Um, thank you for the follow, Martley Amanda. That means the world to me. Welcome to the channel. I hope you're doing well today. Um, you don't have to talk, by the way. I just appreciate you being here. Um, thank you for the bitty titties. Um, you're spoiling me today, with these lone wall. Thank you so much. Um, okay, good effort out there, Scott Bunny. Why don't I get you all sorted? What does that mean? Ah, <laughs> oh, never. You've got a real promise. In fact, I've got a favour to ask you. Be a real rival to Hop. Would you push him and make the both of you stronger? It's kind of cute. I already want to get stronger and stronger. You've seen me battle now, Lee, so come on, you've got to let me take on Pokemon Gym. Oh my god, your little Skull Bunny Teddy. <laughs> yes, we're doing the Skull Bunny playthrough, right? Well, it's my first playthrough, but we chose Sk I chose Skull Bunny. It's only fair if I have the plushie. <laughs> um, you join the gym challenge. You think you're ready for the single greatest competition in the Galar region and not to put in the car before the Rapidash there, little brother. <laughs> Cute. If that's really what you want to do, you two have a whole lot you need to learn about Pokemon, especially your friend Nebu. Before you think about getting gym badges, best to think about getting a Pokedex. A trainer's Pokedex helps them learn a lot, sorry, lots of things about all the Pokemon out there, including their strengths. But it's more than that, just a collection of data. You know, it's a record of a trainer's love and passion for Pokemon training. Right, right, we get it. Pokedex then, we're on it. <laughs> Looks like it's off to the Pokemon Research Lab for you and me, Nebu. Um, that's the kind of enthusiasm a trainer needs. I'll let the professor know to expect you. I'm going to be the next champion, so completing a simple Pokedex will be nothing. Oh, damn. I bet wish he never said that. <laughs> <laughs> um, just another page in the tale of my legend. You'd probably better go tell your mum that we're headed out now. Um, okay. Yeah, I'll go tell me mum. Mum, where you are? Oh, never mind. Never. did you hear that just now? The gate's open and the Wooloo's gone. Guess what, guys? The Wooloo's gone. Scobbing is best choice. Not that I'm biased or anything. Might have been what I chose to. Well, um... I was thinking about Grookey because Rillaboom was really cool, but then I was like, I, 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 I literally know someone that just did a Grookey. Uh, well, it's in, like, pick Grookey as their star, and I'm like, let's pick my own. Everyone knows I love Scalbunny. It's not a secret. <laughs> um, so, you know, it's only fair that I pick this cutie pie. I mean, look at the little plaster. It's so cute. 
Um, Rilla Boom, aka Phil Collins. Oh, damn. Okay, okay. Posture check. That's fair. Uh, H2O. I have a lot of of H2O left. Let's go. Let's do this. Let's win this game. Let's kill Leon, the undefeated cha champion. Let's not go too far. Maybe killing him might not be a thing. Though. But then he'd still be undefeated if you kill him and not defeat him, right? So. He's saving this title. Um, getting mine. Everyone's happy. Um, you don't think it actually broke through there, do you? But it's off limits. Nobody's supposed to go in there. Yeah, I'm sure a little Wulu knows that it's off limits. Hop. Shagoomba. <laughs> Hydration is key. That is true. Have you all hydrated today? Have you all had your water? Um, I'm currently on at least four liters of water a day, plus anything else that I drink. So all the hydrations are actually helping because when I'm off work, I'm not as good as at drinking as I am when I am at work. Because when I'm at work, I like race someone else. I don't know, I'm just really boring. <laughs> just for you shadow lies. How are you doing? It's been a while since I've seen you last. Um, how's, how's Monster Hunter? I keep meaning to play the game. But then Pokemon exists and stops me from playing anything else. <laughs> uh, water, that doesn't sound like a beer to me. You know what, normally I would be on a beer hype with you, but I've got like... Over lockdown I've like not exercised and stuff, so I've got like... A fat belly coming and I'm, I'm not proud of it, so we're trying to be a little bit healthier. Not super healthy, I'm not quitting snacking, snacking's life, but... You know, um... Doing a little bit. <laughs> Um, I remember the professor's god granddaughter went in once and she came back in a real state and that was nothing compared to the earful she got from the professor afterwards. But you say, well I mean we've got to save her, right? Even if we're not supposed to, this is the kind of scene where you simply have to do exactly, exactly hard. Hope you're ready for anything because we're going in there boo. Uh, gonna head out to buy something, but I just drop a lurk here. Meanwhile, how's your day stream so far? My day has been amazing. Thank you very much. It is going to be even better when you come back, though. Please come back in one shit, one piece, one piece. Yes, kind of what I meant. Um, miss you already, and uh, let me know what snacks you buy. <laughs> Um, I had 6 a.m. here and I work for a shift. It's my night time, no problem. Ah, I see, I see, that's understandable. I mean, you're allowed to drink. Like, I'm not, I don't want anyone else to feel bad if they're drinking at any point of the day. Um, I just want to make myself feel bad if I drink at any point of the day. <laughs> um, don't go in the slumbering wield. I think that's meant to say field. <laughs> um,. Well, we're here now, and the graphics looks insane. Oh my god, this is actually really good. What the hell? This is, are we sure this is a Switch game? Did I get a Switch Pro or something? Look at that. Whoa. Okay. Um, <laughs> spooky. <laughs> uh, maybe wake up, and instead of orange juice, you have a beer. I might raise an eyebrow, no cap. Um, I don't even care. Like... There were times in my life where I'd wake up and have a beer for breakfast just because I'd still be drunk from the night before. Um, it's it's important to hydrate. Do you have Sword of Shield? I am currently playing through Shield, um, but I am a happy owner of both. I have lent my other one to my significant other as they have also gotten into Pokemon because um, Pokemon is life, right? So give him a follow, as he is the reason as to why I'm playing this in the first place, because he is the person that has... Well, I mean, I wanted to play Pokemon, but I would not be as obsessed with Pokemon if it wasn't for the fact that um, he's bought me my first ever uh, Shining Fates trainer box, uh, so I could open it on stream, uh, which was absolutely lovely of him to do. Uh, and now I'm obsessed with Pokemon, like, fully, so... <laughs> um, if we don't find that Pokemon soon, this might be trouble. Uh, oh, cute. He is quite cute. <laughs> I'll give him that. Um, okay. <gasps> so poke! Oh, oh my god! Look at this. 
That's why I hate this game, because everything is just cute. Right, I'm gonna see if I can just tackle it, because I am level 7. Almost. The wild squabber used the tail whip. Uh, I've been playing since the 90s, I am obsessed. Okay, I am jealous. My, um, I have never had a Nintendo console up until I was 19. I've said this before. And I only got my 3DS because I wanted to play Fire Emblem. I will never stop telling people this story, by the way. This, I am proud of this story. <laughs> Um, I got Pokemon X just because I finished uh, a title and before my other one arrived, <laughs> sorry, I um, I had some time so I was like, okay, I'll play Pokemon and I played through X and I really enjoyed it. Why do I still have this sticker? So I got my controller from work <laughs> and for some reason I didn't peel the sticker off it. Oh no. Well, that's grime in it. Oh well. Uh, Shna, I've pulled it now. Uh, Squabbit is General Chubbs. Uh, facts. Shall I catch it? Shall I catch it and call it General Chubbs? Or shall I just finish them all off unless I want to capture them? Oof. Um, imagine your first poke in the game and you get a shiny squirrel. <laughs> um, and then you don't get any shinies for the rest of the of your life, right? <laughs> um, I feel your Gen 1 will always be my favourite game. Uh, well, I got a feel of Gen 1 by playing Let's Go Eevee. I know it's not the same. I understand everything that you guys are saying because I am an elitist as well. Uh, but what I am saying is... Um, I'm trying, okay? I want to get up to date with what's currently on the Switch before I go backwards. So I will get an emulator and I will go through the DS games on stream. Um, because they're important. <laughs> uh, doing alright, nice company. Let's be sure you're in tip top shape. Now let's push on. Thank you, Hop. Hop's so lovely. Hop is waifu material, can I just say? Not as cute as his brother, though. Um, Pokemon XD is hands down a favorite Pokemon game. What's Pokemon XD again? I did not mean to do that. Um, sad. I'm sorry. <laughs> a critical hit, oh no. Can I throw a Pokeball at it? Nope. I don't have any Pokeballs, so I can only fight. Right? Yeah, I can only fight. Okay, that's fine. Um, the one on GameCube where there was like Shadow Pokes, Dark Pokes. Oh, okay! That sounds pretty cool. Um, I did have a GameCube, but I only had it for Melee. Uh, and that Fox game. I'm so sorry. Star Fox Adventures, right? Kill the burb. Oh, guys. I'm a pacifist. I don't like killing them. Um. Man. I hear if you don't run, then less appear, right? Is that true? No, I don't remember. Oh, shit. Spoopy noise. Uh, Shadow Lugia was the big boy from that game. Celebi made an appearance, but you couldn't do much with it. Celebi is beautiful. I have a little Celebi tin um, as a token of appreciation for Celebi. Um, it's so cute. Uh, what is it? I've never actually had one in game properly, so I don't know what it actually can do. Um, so I'd be curious to try it. Um, yes, it was the best those Game Boy years. <laughs> um, you know, I, I feel like if I got, my phone just made a noise. One second, I couldn't find it. It made a noise. Like, oh, it's there. It was my only chance to find my phone. <laughs> Um, okay, so 
and nostalgia is real. I'm so, I feel so sad that my parents didn't love me enough to get me a Nintendo console. Um, I always had like PlayStation, but like Nintendo consoles just weren't popular in Poland, which is uh, where I'm from. So I unfortunately, uh, even if I could, wanted to, I couldn't get one because uh, they just weren't around that much and no one had them. Just kind of sucky, I know. I know, I know, guys, I know. But I'm, I'm gonna catch up. Um, Cause I want to. And it may be through an emulator, so it may not be the same, but it will be cheaper, so it won't send me like into bankruptcy. <laughs> uh. I love the little um, plasters that Scorbunny has everywhere. Does, does Scorbunny have those plasters because Scorbunny bun burns itself whenever it uses flaming abilities? Is it just not used to life as a flame Pokemon yet? Those noises are actually really fucking spoopy. Come on, Nebu, that Woolu might be in real trouble. I hope not. Really want a Woolu? Like, IRL though. Because. Who doesn't? Ooh, if you could have any Pokemon in real life as your, like, pet or companion for life, um, not like a significant other, but like, uh, you know, an actual Pokemon type. Uh, so you'd be a trainer, but you could only have one. What would you choose and why? <clears throat> oh, you are beautiful. Arceus reasons. What are the reasons though? Uh, Alohan uh, Vulpix and Nine Tails. So flipping cute. That is an understandable choice. <laughs> I respect both of those choices, but I don't know about the reasons for Arceus, so I want to know more. Why, friend? You tackle it! <laughs> Never, I can't see anything. You okay? Growl at it. Oops. Wrong. Wrong thing. The move is never fun. I can't see anything. Wow. <laughs> I don't know if I'm reading it correctly. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, so if I had to choose one, I'd, oh, this is a tough one. I never choose an Eevee and just never have it evolved. Um, or I would choose a Mew. Mew is like a personal like favorite. Hmm, it's hard to phrase it. It's like divinity, you know. It would be cool to have that at your side. No, I get that. I get that. I guess like if I wanted to have one because I wanted like because it would be cool. It'd be like flexing. I'd probably go with something like Suicune or um, Jurafairy. Is it the the little demon one? I forgot her name. I think they also called her hair. I assume Pokemon gender. I'm so sorry. Please don't cancel me. <laughs> um. Uh, yeah, right, like, power being one part of it, but, like, the other is, like, creation, you know, you could make more of what already is. Okay, okay, I get that. I uh, get it now. I get it now. Okay, that's understandable. Um, no, 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 good, good choices. Um, 
I know people like some people will like choose just like their favorite poke because it looks cute or some people will choose their favorite poke because it's like the coolest sounding thing and like some people choose it because there's just something that they've always had in their pokedex <clears throat> and they just really like it you know it's 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 a personal thing and like the reason as to why I want to know is because I'm genuinely interested in like um, what makes you choose uh, your options in life? Uh, of course I came looking for the both of you. Wait, where's the Wooloo? We were trying to rescue that Wooloo. Ah! <laughs> Little chaps just fine. Now all of you had fainted by the time I found you here. You know this place is out of balance, but it's encouraged to come in here all the same. And I can understand well enough why you did it. You did good hop. And at least that's Wooloo's alright. At least that Wooloo is alright. Uh, yeah, Nabu. I thought we'd had it when that weird fog started rolling in and that mad Pokemon attacks. But at least it wasn't all for nothing. Attacked by some mad Pokemon? What you talking about, Hop? It seemed loads stronger than any Pokemon I've ever seen and it had just this sort of presence of... Our moves didn't even touch it. I mean, really, they seemed to pass right through it. Your moves pass right through it. So the fearsome Pokemon, they say, live in the slumbering world. Um, are they actually illusions or something? Get strong enough and maybe the two of you could be the ones to reveal the truth someday. For now, let's simply get out of here, this place. Uh, you'll be alright now that I'm here with you. A walk. I'm always alright when Leon's around. <laughs> oh, very good point. The possibilities would be endless. Um... If you have a Mewtwo, they'd probably just hate humanity, so they would wipe anyone and everyone for you. So if you wanted power, Mewtwo would be a good choice as well. Uh, she'll go spare you if you leave without a word, even worse than Lee just did. Right, I'm going to Mew Mum. Is this Mew Mum? Oh my god, there's two of you! Sorry, I'm gonna stop. That's pretty cute though. Mom! Mom! Of course she's in the kitchen. <laughs> well, now, isn't Scorbunny just a sweetheart? And yes, I heard the news from young Leo and I'm glad someone bothered to tell me. Off to Wedgehurst, aren't you? Here we are. A bit of pocket money for your journey. Buy yourself a little something at the Pokemon Center, maybe some potions or something. Remember that Scorbunny will battle to the very end. So no, you go pushing a poor deer too hard. Uh, there! And you, Scorbunny, look after my little Nabu. Yeah, look after me, Scorbunny. Um, come home to rest any time that you need. After all, east or west, home is best. <laughs> Cute. Um, Mewtwo's canon was to hate humanity, but he would never hurt a poke except in defense. I mean, you got like a murderer, bro, what the fuck? I mean, like, we all know why Mewtwo's like this though, don't we? Like, we've seen his movie. Well, I haven't. I will watch his movie. I have, however, watched a lot of YouTube stuff, uh, because I'm just interested. Uh, I just, like, I don't have the time to watch everything, so I'll get to it, but, um, please don't hate me. <laughs> um, Route 1. Here we go, this is quite a big step, you know. My first step towards becoming the next champion. Guess I'll probably train up Grookey a bit by having it battle against Pokemon and tall grass. You should get yourself to the building with the purple roof and the great red and white bell. Ball. Ball. Ball, not bell. <sighs> Mark out on front. That's the Pokemon Research Lab. Um, and like, Mewtwo's cannon just like, upsets me so much. It is so sad how like, there was four posts in one human clothes. And like, how they all just like, faded and it was just Mewtwo. And oh my god, nah. Nah. <laughs> It's very really sad, okay. Oh, no, 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 let me...
Okay. Um. Let's keep Takoda. <laughs> yeah, that's fair. I mean, without spoiling much, they made a Pokemon like me to accept the best dietary trait in this game is called Type Null. Humans, a eh? humans are scumbags. They always will be. I don't mind spoilers that much because I do kind of watch too many things regarding Pokemon, so I end up spoiling things myself. Um, but I don't actually think I heard about this one. Lag grew to level 8 and learned Quick Attack. Woo! Go you, you cutie pie. Eh. Whoops. It's really hard to navigate this when you're pretending that you're a score buddy. <gasps> There's a woo loo there. Like, is this gonna be a Pokeball or is it a potion? Potion. I want a Pokeball. Alright. You encountered a wild plummet. <clears throat> Well, they wanted to create a power accident and I'm making like a fucking Frankenstein power absolutely appalling. That sounds beautiful, I cannot wait to find it. Man, Squabber is just making me think of snacky snacks. My hamster does this a lot as well. His cheeks just go whenever I give him any food because he doesn't trust me enough to eat in front of me yet. So he'll just put in his cheeks for later. It's kind of scary, but kind of cute. Pokemon gain experience points. Uh, you gotta beat the game, but it's free. Okay. Well, I do have like some free DLC for a Gigantamax. Uh, something. Sel Selaz is it Selaz? No, Sand Slash. I can't remember. The game will give out codes for free, basically, and I got. Uh, oh no. The wild root bees peck. No, you peck me, friend. Wait, I have a Pokeball. I have five Pokeballs. Oh, you don't have to try to throw them. That's absurd. Pow! Gotcha, Rook D was caught. The music when you catch a Pokemon is my favourite thing in this game. Nothing makes me feel, like, so good. Alright, what should we name Rook D? This is, this is difficult. Um... You guys can choose. <laughs> you guys are good at naming things. I'm just here to entertain. Right? Right? Um. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Uh, I'm sure names, I named my yellow Lucario Lemon Sour and my Rillaboom Groot Kek W, okay, okay, that's fine. I'm also bad at names. Um, I mean, I'm not gonna keep him, so I'm just gonna not name him and move on. Burb. Burb was perfect. <laughs> right, Wooloo is important to me. We're gonna catch Wooloo. And I want you guys to think of a good name for Wulu. Now I'm gonna keep your first catch, imagine. I'm sorry, am I doing something wrong? Yay! 
caught the Wooloo, guys. It's 100% catch rate. They need no. Oh, okay. Thanks, Blair. <laughs> I did not know that. I thought you have to get them weak. I, um, I mean. Oh. I just meme you're doing fine. Okay, okay. Would you like to give Wooloo a nickname? Um. Can I name it? Whoops. Guys, I accidentally didn't name it. But it's fine, you can still name it later. Right. Oh, I still need to catch this quava, even if I don't intend to keep it, so we'll add it to a Pokedex, right? That's how this game works. Go, Claire! Whew. Right. Just go to the Pokeball Pokedex. Um. Um, one second. Your Pokemon game experience points. Um. General Chubbs. Yeah, that was it, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Whoops. One second. Uh, <laughs> right. General. Whoops. Whoops. I'm used to a PlayStation and you can really tell when I fucking do these things. General. Where's Y? <laughs> I probably make you all regret your life when I do this. Oh no, I can only do Chubb. It will have to stay. It's General Chubb. I do like that this game brought in like a perma experience, yeah. Even better. Um, it's nice, isn't it? Okay, sorry. Um, let me get this item. Paralyzed heals. That's cool. Nothing's paralyzed me yet. Um. Wow, look at this beautiful Charizard. Rar XD. I love it. Meh. Right, I'm gonna stop being weird and I'm just gonna go where they told me to. Hello, Daddy Leon. Well done. You reached the goal and managed to find a Pokemon research lab. You did the fast side better than I did my first time on my first of directions. See how your whole world has already grown. All thanks to having Pokemon with you. I know I'm sure glad I've got Charizard with me to keep me from getting lost all the time. Now in Wico. <laughs> Imagine having a fucking ch d it's not black, the fuck. Yeah, I know. I was thinking that. And also, imagine, like, saying you're really grateful for your Charizard, but you're only grateful for him because he's shown you directions, because you're hopeless at directions. <laughs> oh, no way. Oh, it's a Yampa! You are so cute! She's pretty fit. Looking into looking for and for another never before seen super strong Pokemon. I wish you'd stop with these outlandish requests. I have a shiny Gigantamax Charizard. That sounds incredibly impressive. I have a skull body that we named Flair, and I really love it. <laughs> Uh, good to see you too, Yampa. Yampa here is a real champ when it comes to helping you find your way around. He came to my rescue plenty of times back in the day when I got lost on the road. <laughs> uh, oh yeah, and that's his trainer, Sonia. What can I say about Sonia? Well, I like the way she cooks. She makes food you can gobble down in a flash. What kind of introduction is that? Did you forget we were rivals during our gym challenge? It was just yeah, for helping you out, I did too. An orange Charizard, so 1998. <laughs> I'll respect that, that's a good one. 
Uh, this is Nebu. She's a new Pokemon trainer. Set her on the right path with you. <laughs> this Yamper is mad cute. What does he think I am? He's always got his head in a cloud. It's no wonder he gets lost all the time. Ooh, looks like you've got a rotten phone. Hey there, rotten. Bzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzzz
Yes, perfect. I hope he doesn't fall into my thing. Right. Or like a hammock hanging from the mic to screen, bro. Be chilling. <laughs> That'd be perfect, actually. <laughs> uh, we've got a float soul. We had a weasel. Now we have a float soul. I think this may be the pack. <laughs> Uh, yep, we've got a Dartrix. We had a Rowlet and now we have a Dartrix. I'm gonna keep saying this the whole time. Um, we've got a cute little Snom. I really don't understand this Pokemon, but it's cute, but also looks a little bit like a melon. <laughs> um, then we have, oh, we've got our cutie Grookey. Look at this beautiful boy playing with his uh, stick. Please focus. Oh, he's not going to. There we go. He's focusing on the scar, buddy. Not fair. <laughs> right. Then we have a cute little Eevee just swimming. Um, don't really know why she's swimming, I'm not gonna lie, but let's let her. Mons is a snom backwards. That is correct. You are not wrong. <laughs> uh, we've got this angry boy, not angry boy, sorry, hamster boy more Peko with a snubble and a burb. I'm sorry, I don't remember burb's name. Um, I actually really like more Peko. Don't know if it's available in this game, but I know its trainer is um, someone that I'm going to to be battling here. Rukadi is the name of the. Thank you, Lone Wolf. Really appreciate it. You think Snum looks like a what? <laughs> a bellend. <laughs> um, we've got a Tootle. Looking very smug. Um, it's a Sword and Shield exclusive. Oh, okay. That's pretty neat. I like that. Um, oh, shit. My reverse is a Trapinch. I didn't know we were already in the reverse section. I already have two of these. This is my third. <laughs> uh, and my last card is... Ah! Yes. A Vulcanian. I think I already have you as well. Um, fear not. One of these packs has to be good. Like, actually good. So one of these packs that I opened today has to contain something of importance. It's fine. Steam boy. Boy be steaming. Right. I'm just gonna hold it. <laughs> nice, nice, nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're doing good. We're doing good. We're doing good. Let's 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 play the game for a little bit. Um just a little bit, not too long. <laughs> right. Um this yamper is beautiful. Yamp yamp. Okay. So Hey there, trainer. Sorry to stop you. You just left the Pokemon lab, right? So that means you've got a Pokedex. I love talking to new trainers and giving them useful stuff. This guy's just wholesome. Thank you for the medicine. It's a potion. Use it when your Pokemon's HP um, gets low. HP is like Pokemon stamina. You can even use potions during battle. That's cool. Uh, H2 oh. <clears throat> oh my god, my voice is going. Uh, knowledge is power. It's a good idea to talk to lots of different people and read everything you can on your journey. Not bad. Right. Meh. I've just remembered what the sign here used to say. To the right is the Pokemon lab, on the opposite side is the station. I love giving new trainer stuff because they're a potion you can buy from the shop around the corner for ten dollars. Ten dollars is a lot of shackles, yo. <laughs> uh, get a bug type for the first gym. Okay, I got your Pokedex from Sonya, then it's time to meet lots of different Pokemon and start building up a strong team. But battling strong Pokemon in the wild can leave your team in a bad way, not to mention what battling another trainer can do. Luckily we've got Pokemon sensors. Look here yet, they're dead easy to spot, they look the same wherever you go. Um, or will Scarbunny carry you? I think Scarbunny will carry me through like the first two or three gyms, I can't remember. Uh, 
I um, didn't read a guide, I just watched someone play and they used to call money everywhere. <laughs> um, so, yeah, might, 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 might try that strat, sorry. I keep losing my um, camera stuff. There it is. Okay, one sec, I need to load my note. The first gym is grass. Oh, bro, I don't even have to try them. scarbony has got it caught covered. I'm gonna sit it here because I think it's the best spot for it without me like squeezing him and making him look weird. Okay, come on, Nebu. Bet you've never been inside one. Uh, excuse me? Level with me, Nebu. Is this your first time in a Pokemon Center? Of course not! Then I don't think you need me to tell you what you already know. If you two kids are Pokemon trainers, you might want to buy some potions before you head out. Cheers, I'm already good though. I'm heading to Route 2, Nebu. Come find me when you're done here. Um... Oh, it's an Ndidi! Oh, what a cutie! I love Ndidi. Can you get Ndidi in this game or is it just someone's... Uh... I don't know why I'm resting them. Excuse me? Excuse me, what? Nandiska. Thanks for waiting. Scorbunny and the rest of your team should be all better now. We hope to see you again. Welcome to the Pokemart. May I help you? Hey, hey. Huh? May I help you? Indeedy is epic. Indeedy is beautiful. Right, potion. Oh, wait, can you not buy Pokeballs? Am I weird for once in Pokeballs? What's going on? Right, let's buy 10 parts. Let's buy 10 parts. Yes. Later on, but Leon gives you some. Leon didn't give me enough. I already used some. Oh wait, did he just get- no, I mean when you walk up that. Oh, okay. Okay, okay, that makes more sense. <laughs> I like to be prepared for like anything and everything, so I buy like five of these all shits that I may or may not use throughout my gameplay. Uh, like I shouldn't really need a revive at this point, but I'll just get one just in case. Um, uh, oh, thanks. Do come again. What does this guy do? Got some Pokemon questions? Feel free to ask. Oh, that's the guy that you can rename your Pokes app. Okay, cool. Can't buy fruit. Sad. I just throw the strongest Pokemon and roll with that. Uh, I mean, I completed Let's Go Eevee by using nothing but Eevee, so... <laughs> Yeah, I don't, I don't really like to use too many parents. I just like, I don't know, I'm really bad at keeping like swapping in between because I'm impatient, so yeah. If you're a Pokemon trainer now, you must want to try your hand at the gym challenge, right? The gym challenge, mate! You can tell he's British. The annual competition where trainers can battle it out for the right to challenge the champion. But the trick is that you've got to be endorsed if you want to take part. And Lee doesn't seem to think I'm up to snuff, so I'm thinking I ought to talk to the professor and I'm thinking. 
Oh my god. This guy talks a lot. Nothing but Eevee, not even an evolution. Whoa, actual gamer. <laughs> I did have evolutions in the bag uh, for a bit of it, but then I swapped them with the um, legendary burbs. Because, oh wait, I think Grandma lives here, doesn't she? Let's go see. Say hello to Grandma. She gave us a Pokedex after all. Whoops. Right, this is here. Leon loves Pokemon and loves Pokemon battles. I remember he would always go all out. No, I don't think this is here. Sonia and Leon used to have a healthy friendship relationship. I don't know. In order to bring out the full strength of the Pokemon trainers must be knowledgeable. Do do do. <laughs> What's this guy? You see that house in the distance with the purple roof? That's where Pokemon Professor lives. Okay, cool. Um, you can't evolve partners. Uh, yeah, 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 I, I, I know you, I, I knew you couldn't evolve the Eevee. I did have Eevee Lucians in my bag, though. Um, Route 2. Over here, Nabu. Right, this nickname for Galarian Articuno, Amethyst. That's a cute nickname, that's very lovely. I feel like a lot of the time, if, like, a lot of my mates, what they do is when they come and when I catch like a Pokemon, they'll give it either a really stupid name or they'll give it a name that's like referencing them. Alexandrite. Ooh, oh, okay. Amethyst feels generic, but 8 out of 10. Um, I mean, they're both lovely. Uh, and I'm here to teach you how you'll need to catch Pokemon if you've got any hope of filling in that Pokebox. Where'd you come from? <laughs> oh, look at you, little Neb. Well, you've already caught some on your own. Your mum gave you those Pokeballs, did she? I'll give you some more Pokeballs in return. I'll only ask that you catch plenty of Pokemon. The Pokemon around here seem easy to catch, almost like they're itching to join some trainers' team. What did you say? That's cute. Um, epic. Epic gamer moment. Um, you put the Pokeballs in your po bag's Pokeballs pocket. That was a lot of words. The Pokemon on your team will get experience points when you catch Pokemon too. And of course they get experience points from battles to take on other trainers you meet along the or path to help your Pokemon thrive. Your team will keep on changing and growing as you get stronger together, no doubt. But even I don't know exactly how yet. Show your champion something good, alright? I want to please... Please Leon. Alright, I'm gonna catch loads of Pokemon. The professor will be shocked when she sees. Certified Hood Classic. Hood Hood Classic. Hood Hood Hood. Bruh. <gasps> Hello, you beautiful nicket. I just got a card of that, didn't I? Oh, I Did you say I can just throw Pokeballs at them? Is it because they're on the level 10 they just easy? Swiper now. You mean Swiper is his new name? Right. Nickit's data will be added to the Pokedex. Would you like to give Nickit a nickname? Swiper. What does he swipe? Left on Tinder? <gasps> Dangerous Asian- Oh shit, one second. One second, Curio. There's only one thing I care about more than you redeeming out for reveal. It's Yampa. Uh, wait, do you not know Swiper? I feel like I don't, but I should, shouldn't I? I'm really sorry, please don't hate me. Right, let's catch this beautiful... Um... Kiri, you're gonna be happy, today's outfits are actually, like, joggers. Dora. Dora for... As in Dora the Explorer, for Yampa. Are y'all sure? I mean, I'm just gonna do it, if you say so, but, you know. Right, let me. I'm gonna do you a favour since I'm getting up. I'm gonna do this. 
So today's outfit is a t-shirt from Uncle's, um, well he's not actually my uncle, he's just my good mate. Uh, he makes them, it's really dope. I uh, really like it, I don't think he's into it. And to think I almost wore joggers today. <laughs> um, okay, let's go back to the normal one. Slippers from Dora. Dora the Explorer has a thieving fox that steals her stuff. Nick it evolves into feeble. Okay. I mean, I knew Nick it evolves into feeble, um, but I didn't. I don't watch Dora. I'm really sorry, guys. I should know this. I, I'm sorry. I'll do better next time. <laughs> much creative drippy so yampa is drippy um i'm really sorry but yampa is the one time i have to name it myself uh, and the reason for that is because big pog got a love skirts with fish heads. <laughs> i'm glad you like the do uh curio how are you today i've missed you you've like not talking to me at all you come into my streams once for like five minutes and then that's it Hey, how are you doing? Not Noah Games. How are you? I am good. Um, yeah, I am good. Sorry. How are you yourself, more importantly? I'm a little bit ill, so I may sound a little bit nasally, but uh, excited to be here. Understandable you haven't seen it. I mean, I've seen the um, Handy Manny, and that's a Spanglish show, is it not? Because he always counts in Spanish and other things. Uh, right. So, Yampa unfortunately has to be called cheddar and if it was a female yampa it would have been a basic bitch now the reason for that is one of my most beloved um series of all time which is um brooklyn 99 elizabeth <laughs> no it's cheddar Alright. Cheddar's very important. <laughs> um bow, bow, bow. Yes, poggers. Poggy poggies. Alright, we're all happy now. Oh my goodness! It's a zigzagoon! That's the Galarian zigzagoon, right? Like, the queen loves corgis. Queen does love corgis, that is a fact. Um I also love corgis, they're so cute. I don't know if it's a dog that I'll add one, because like, I'd, I feel like I'd want too many dog types if I just said yes to them all. Um, but corgis are really high up for me. We named the Zigzagoon something. just playing the story yes this is my first time playing through shield um i am slowly but surely getting through it <laughs> there's a lot of interruptions uh i don't think i'm gonna put the zigzagoon into my party so i'm gonna just put it in the box and uh keep him as a zigzagoon because he will just get sent um, right, let's just just keep capturing stuff Go, Flare! Name and let's just send them to the box. 
Hello. Wobbit, you cutie pie. Ow. Yay. The catch everything you see strapped. I like it. <laughs> Whoops. Um, look, it's just... You just get more experience that way. I was going to rush things and get as soon as I can the the Galarian Ponyta, but I forgot to research where you get the Galarian Ponyta and I don't want to do it on the stream in front of everyone. So I'm just not going to rush through things. I mean, it really is for duplicates, you could just KO. Yeah, but Pokeballs don't cost that much, especially the free ones. Is that a real Scorbunny I see? Yeah, we got a real Scorbunny in the house. He's just chilling watching his brother do Scorbunny things in the game. <laughs> uh, Noah, do you... Uh... What's your favourite Pokemon? It's on it. It's in that forest. Um, but yeah, I mean, I've done an Oddish army as well, so I get it, to be honest. So I, my army would be Galarian Ponytars. I'm really sorry. Uh, why would it be a Galarian Monita? Um, because they're cute. XOXO, Gossip Girl. <laughs> it's in that forest. Oh wait, you mean there's a Scorbunny in the forest? <gasps> it's a trainer boy. He looks English. He looks very English. Yeah, Noah, what is your favourite Pokemon? And why is it me? <laughs> Uh, it's common manners for Pokemon trainers to battle when they're always me. A child. Hunt him. <laughs> oh, he's got a little squabbit Christmas tree. Are those, not, are those Doritos? Why is that squabbit pooping Doritos? Not Doritos. Doritos. Oh my god. What is going on? <laughs> Alright. Now we fight him. How? The opposing squabbit used tackle and he did shnut along. But that's better, let's use a quick attack. KO. That's tough, but I would have to say Electrovire. Electrovire. Okay, that is a unique choice. Um, I respect that. What, what makes you say that though? You defeated youngster Jake. Whatever does a strong trainer always look right at them. You get 360 Pokeboys. Pokeboys? Yes, I get 360 Pokeboys. Woo! Ooh, Bub. Hello, Bub. Let me capture you. Oh, this is actually trying to fight me. You know what? I'm just gonna... Win. I remember watching the DP anime when I was a kid and I just fell in love with his design. Okay, that's, that's actually respectable. Like, I think that's a good choice. Um, just unusual in my opinion, but I, I, I can get behind it. <laughs> um, mine would probably be Zero or uh, Okay. Also a wise a wise choice, good choice. No no no. Um why Zero Aura though? I hate two out. I don't think I have any of this. Let me get my other bottle of water. Okay. 
Prince Aurora is epic. Okay. <laughs> it's fun. I respect that. Let's go this way because there's a Pokeball. Two potions! Woo! You encountered a wild root kitty. Go, Claire. Your hair is dope. Oh, thank you. It's actually fading a lot from red, so it's gone like purpley because there used to be a lot of blue. Um, so, yeah. It's, it's proven challenging as it fades, but it's fine. Um, can't wait to re dye it. <laughs> Uh, the Rookie D, as in the word, works well with a song I like. Uh, your hair reminds me of a jinx. Wait, or oh, wait, Rookie D reminds you of a jinx on me. Ow! Your Rook, the wild Rookie D faded. Um, JK. I mean, if you mean it, I don't, I don't mind. Jinx is a cutie. Ow! Um, shall I heal up? I thought that was a shiny because it used Leer and I just heard the sound. Oh, okay. Uh, Jinx is whack. Oh. I mean, I don't mind Jinx that much. I do not like the fact that it was like, I don't know, it has like some potentially racist undertones, but um, I guess the issue was resolved, but whatever. Uh, there was a controversy over his skin color, yeah, yeah. So, it looked a lot like they were trying to. Um, do like what they did with the minstrel shows, uh, over exaggerated features, etc., of uh, black people. Um, Pope, like Nintendo said that they were actually just um, done as an inspiration of the girls that would be walking on the streets because um, around that time there was a lot of those girls that would like have orange faces. And then they'd wear a lot of like white makeup around the like was the eyes and like lips. I think I don't know. Like I watched the thing about it and I was like looking at it and I was like, I'm pretty sure those girls are also doing it not because they're like faces, but they're kind of clueless. They don't understand that it just looks like. A minstrel show again, but I, I don't know. I, I just... It's a toodle. Um, so yeah. Little chompy. Let me get it. Ha. Wait, they changed into purple. Yeah, she was originally black, then they made it like a purple to uh, get away with at keeping her. I mean, have you seen the Jinx special for Christmas? How, I think it was how Jinx stole Christmas. That was a little bit racist. It was like, along with the skin colour, that, that did not age well.
But I'm like, ah, but I must have taken the Ashgar must have been yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> That's unfortunate for Ash. <laughs> I take it and uh, no one doesn't like Jinx. What's wrong with Jinx? I don't know. Um, I don't like mind games, so I'm just gonna remove that attack. Lol and smooch. <laughs> Right, what are we naming Tootle? What are we naming Tootle? What are we naming Tootle? Let's go. Hefty chunk. <laughs> I don't know if I can fit that, but I'll try. Oh, it fits. Right, hefty chunk it is. Um... Okay, let's add him to a party and let's swap him out with the roofy. Turns into a turtle, what a chunk. Snapping turtle. Cute. Don't remember what it was called though. I can beat her, but I'm gonna beat you. How bad are you? You were challenged by Youngster Benjamin. Looks full of hope. Youngster Benjamin sent out a blip bug. Pound his tiny ass. <laughs> oh, child. <laughs> I love double kickers in this hack. Cinderace could do that to be honest. Right, the opposing blip a bug a fainted. Damn. Your Pokemon gained experience points. Let's go. Against the Benjamin is about to say nick it. Will you switch your Pokemon? No, I never switch. Against the Benjamin said that nick it. Fight. Uh, let's just that double kick. Ooh. Okay. Uh, why does every kid in this game got a sweater on? <laughs> what's wrong? What's wrong with kids wearing sweaters? Uh, Cinder is to put the child on football. <laughs> when does every oh, wait? Okay, okay. Cinder is to get demolished in football. Okay. <laughs> um, maybe, maybe. I would laugh if you get the virus card. Um, you mean if I got the uh, shiny Charizard? I already pulled the shiny Charizard. It's just me and Flopsy decided to sell it. Uh, he has it in his folder until we sell it. It kind of upsets me that he has it in his folder, but he's also like willing to get up on his eBay and let me put it up online. So, um, anyway, um, Pokemon cards. The next one is oh another Charizard. They're kind of dripping, but it looks hot. <laughs> what? Oh, uh, let me show you guys what I got for buying the, um, So, in, um, Britain, 
uh, because there's football on. Uh, there's these cars that you can get. Um, they're like they're called like Score Bunny on the ball, Evie on the ball. Uh, there's obviously Brookie and a Sobble as well. I don't know when the Sobble ones are coming out, um, but I have about seven Score Bunnies now. Uh, two or three Grookies. Mm, no Eevees because the Eevee ones were around before the pandemic hit, and that was when I was not into the Eevees yet. Not in sorry, not into cards yet. So yeah, um, I've missed out on that, but hopefully I'll buy one on eBay when they're like a little bit cheaper than 40 quid. Because 40 quid for a card is a lot of money. So, um, without me rambling on, let's get into these. So we've got another Charizard. Could this be the one? Could this be the one? You guys don't know how to open these. <laughs> Right, so you guys can't see the top card because then you know whether it is good or bad. Um, booster. So what are we going to do? We're going to open it like this. Oh my god. Right. And then we're going to put one, two, three from the top to the bottom. So the top one should be a fighting energy card. And then we go from the bottom, right? I think so. Or do we go from the top? I think we go from the bottom. Right. Uh, there you go. So our first one is a Thwacky. Fruity's evolution. Right before he goes into a Villa Boom. Uh, kind of still cute, but not that cute. <laughs> I hope you get me. <laughs> um, then we've got a Rusted Sword. With a beautiful boy in the background. Uh, is it Tian, is it? I think. I think the, the other one is Amazenta. Uh, Brilla Boom Sexy. LOL. Uh, Rotom! I actually really like the design of Rotom. I think he's kind of cute. Uh, don't know what this one's doing. He's just chilling with some butt. Little nerd. Oops. Uh, there we go. We've got another Nicket. Um, hmm. I don't really know what to say, other than the fact that I just beat one! Woo! I named Zetian a Femir and Zamazan said Bowwool. Okay. Wait, you get them in this game? I mean, of course you get them, but I didn't know you can capture them before. They're just like a legend. Um... Then we've got Cacnea, the least liked Pokemon by me. And then we've got a little few fun. Uh, really cute, if you've seen the guy have it at the beginning of the game. Uh, then we have another Eevee just swimming. I don't know if Eevee is swimming for their day in life or if they're just enjoying it. It's really hard to tell from the facial expression. So let's hope that they're in no trouble. Uh, then we've got another Weasel. Um... Then we have, oh, oh guys, look at this! It's a Clubopus shiny holographic card. Very nice, very nice. Do like that design, very cute. Um, and the last card is just Professor's Research. So unfortunately nothing important on the last card, but this one was good. Let's get it sleeved up, yo. I'm getting all the shinies, but all the wrong ones. I'm gonna complain to the sales assistant that got me this uh, Pokemon pack. Right. Uh, let's give it a sleevey sleevey. Wait, this one has shit on it. What does it have shit on it? Right. There we go, that's our second shiny of the day. Our first one, if you weren't here, was this uh, Dracovish. Dracovish, I never know how to pronounce it. It's not too bad, two shinies. Uh, I just got a shiny Clubopus today. Ooh! Uh, in the game or as a card? Because I got a card. <laughs> Alright, let's carry on playing. 
I'd like to do at least one gym today. <laughs> um... <clears throat> Wooloo boots level 8. Wooloo learn copycat. Great. Oh, in the game. Impressive. Was it an accident or was you hunt hunting one? Got 420 Pokeboys for winning. Woo! Right. Toodle. excited when I see TVs. Look at that stupid face. Uh, can I just say that if you if you remove low pad like yellow bit you can see its mouth which means that the yellow bit is his mustache which makes him a lot less cute. Uh, I joined the red and it was just shiny. Nice! That's fucking amazing. Well done man. Proud of you. Proud of you. You're doing great. Keep up the good work. Okay. So. I recommend leveling your Pokemon up to evolve them so that they are overpowered. Um, maybe, we'll see. I don't want to like spend too long leveling up. What level does it have to be to uh What level does the strawberry evolve? Is it into Cinderbrace? And then the last one is I don't even remember guys. 10 or 15 I think. He's already 10 so it would have to be 15. I don't know. <laughs> Fair enough. Right. Ah! Hello! Hoot hoot! 16 out of 32 for starters and no. I started it in 2019. It's 16. Okay, thank you. Much you appreciate her. We can get it to 16 before the next gym. The next gym's ages away, isn't it? Like, I feel like I've been doing a lot of stuff that's not gym related. Hoot Hoot's data will be added to the Pokédex. They like to give Hoot Hoot the nickname. I'm not gonna put him with me. What sort of cosplay, anime, or video game? That will be up for people to decide. <laughs> so once I get closer to the big number, I will um, make like a few like polls and questions. <laughs> we both on it. <laughs> you guys were both like instantly like all world cosplay. Uh, so yeah, it will be decided by viewers whether it's from a game and then what game it's from, etc. Um, I'll uh, be taking suggestions on that. Just curious. <laughs> That's fine. I mean, if I had to decide, um, I would happily do. Uh, you know, I'm trying to think what I actually would want to do. Misty's like a kind of given, like Misty's cool. I like Misty. If you pick cool, you pick though. Cause like I respect Misty, but also I feel like Misty's just too easy to do as a thing. So maybe as a 1k, I'd probably try something better. Maybe like a gender bent. Um... Panicky Ken from Tokyo Ghoul. I don't know. Uh, Hood Hood has two legs. <laughs> okay. Is he not supposed to? You found a repel. Sick.
Pokemon music and sound effects go so hard for no reason. They really do, don't they? This music is slapping. I feel like the stars are legendary because they are strong and rare and less bread. Uh, that is correct. You don't see too many starters in this game. In most games, to be fair. Just is what it is. Look, there's the professor. So, have you unraveled all the secrets of the Dynamax phenomenon yet? Oh goodness, no. The whole thing is still full of questions. I'd hoped that my granddaughter would take over my research, but she is who in love with you, Leon. Dear me, I'm sorry, I didn't even notice my guests. She is one stylish grandma. My name is Magnolia. Welcome, young trainers. Now come, let's head indoors. The starters of this game are shiny look like a true legendary as well. Mm. What if you take hops or you lose for a star, lol? <laughs> uh, you must be Nebu. I trust you received the Pokedex from Sonya. I'm sure you'll have to complete it in no time. <laughs> you must already know about Dynamax right never. Professor McNally has been doing research into the Dynamax phenomenon for years and years and it takes a proper understanding of the thing if you plan to use Dynamax into the fullest. There you go again, Leon. Always talking about Pokemon. There are other things that are worth knowing about too, you know. Like how many different types of tea there is. <laughs> I don't know if that's like an insult because it's a British game, but... I know, you can probably get them easy if, with G2s and surprise trade. Yeah, but they are bread. I said them as bread. Bread. I help me convince Lee he should endorse us for the gym challenge. I mean, if someone has a shiny scarbony in this game and is willing to give it to me, I'm your girl. Oh, Leon, why wouldn't you endorse them? Up and never only just started as Pokemon trainers. There's still loads they don't know yet. Well, my bad. <laughs> Dear, I thought your dream was to have everyone in the Gallon region become strong trainers, isn't that right? Well, yeah, you're not wrong. That goal is precisely the reason I gave them both Pokemon, in fact. Right then, in that case, how about this? Let's see if the two of you can show me such a brilliant battle that I'm left with no choice but to endorse you. And don't worry, I'll make sure both your teams are in good shape before the battle starts. That it's good, I was just saying. Okay, okay, okay. I'll be waiting outside, Nabu. Oof. Cash me outside, how about that? <coughs> I'm gonna wander around Magnolia's house, see if I can spawn if I go. Whoa. Whose bedroom is this? Is it that girl? Yeah, there's a Yampa. Yeah, this is, um... Oh, Sonia's, isn't it? Doesn't really tell me a lot about anything. Hurry it up, Nabu. You've got to battle me so I can get myself that endorsement. <sighs> I'm going to become the greatest Pokemon trainer there is, and to do that, I need that endorsement to take part in the gym challenge. Come at me with everything you have so we can prove to Lido we've got what it takes. You want the shiny reboot? I do want the shiny reboot. This reboot is beautiful. I mean, look at him. Um, I'm rather interested in seeing you two, how you two young trainers battle to <gasps> Flop T tier free for nine months. Thank you, thank you. How are you doing? Oh, um, 
No shiny from the A today. Guess I'll start breeding the Lowland Bull Pigs tomorrow. Well, anyway, hope you have a good stream. See you all. Thank you, Boomstick, for coming. Thank you for the follow. I hope you have a fantastic day, man. And I will catch you later. Uh, good luck with breeding. Um, um, how are you doing, Flopty? How's work today? Are you on your break now? Or are you just, just lurking? Uh, I'm rather interested in seeing how you two young traders battle too. Listen you two, the reason I'm unbeatable is because I learn from every battle I see or take part in. That's how I've gotten to where I am today. So show me something good in this battle. It's time for my legend to begin. You are challenged by Pokemon Trainer Hawk. You wanna train now? Uh, can we train now? Do we not have to announce any further in the game to train? Uh, have you gotten a bit stronger? Me and my team will put you to the... I can't read that. Oh, he is so on the level compared to me. The Pokemon has hit two times. Well, look at you, since you've really learned your type matchups. I really haven't. <laughs> I'm just using my score buddy. Oh, his little Grookey is level fucking. Oh, I'm so sorry, Grookey. It's super effective. Have a taste of our true power. Our green power just keeps on. I just didn't read that. Branch poke. <laughs> Cute. A critical hit. Right. Well, let's use Ember on him again, even though I don't need to because I can just finish him with a normal attack. But it's super effective! A critical hit! You landed a critical hit on my Pokemon, you've got plenty of spirit. Your Pokemon gained experience points. Swiper grew to level 10. Pokemon Trainer Hop is about to send out Rookie D. Will you switch your Pokemon? Nope. <laughs> It'll be a close one, but that's exactly my sort of match. Bro, you haven't even, like, scratched! Um, Alright, let's use Ember. enough to finish it. Your Pokemon gained experience points. <clears throat> he defeated Pokemon Trainer Hawk. Oof, good at that I lost, but I'd expect nothing less from my rival. You got 640 for winning. Woo! Hi friend! Hi! How you doing ADC or go home? What you up to? Nebu hop. Well, after seeing a match like that one, I suppose I have little choice but to give you both an endorsement as champion. You've obtained a letter of endorsement. You put the letter of endorsement in your bag's key items. I am working. Oh, I'm so sorry. Uh, if I give it to you though, you've got to use it in the playthrough. I mean, I would have just replaced my actual score bunny with it. Um, shiny as cute. So I will definitely use it in the playthrough. Because I tend to keep my starter Pokemon until the end. Um, I'm sorry that you won't work in the... Um, I hope work's not too bad today though. You're missing out on quality Pokemon gameplay, which upsets me. Uh, honestly, I'd been worried you're still obsessing over that sort of nonsense, but it seems you really have grown a bit, little brother. 
and I'd like to see some more Frillin' Pokemon battles out of you two, Nabu. Alright, Nabu, you and me are going to train up against one another to aim that champion's title. Absolutely. The more we keep battling against one another, the more our Pokemon will grow. Nah, I gotta get that money. Gotta go. Huh? What's that? Ooh. <clears throat> they are wishing stars since there are two of them you should take one yourself you obtain the wishing star you put the wishing okay stone found in the galar region with a mysterious power it's said that your dreams come true if you find one oh, that's cute trust you pull some trust trust you to pull something like this they say wishing stars fall down for those who have a true wish in their heart you know I will be the greatest trainer ever. I will be the greatest trainer ever. I will be the greatest trainer ever. There are some free times, so surely my wish will come true now. Don't be silly, help. Those wishing stars are composed of a curious sort of rock containing unknown power. They are one of the most precious resources we have here in the Gala region. But they don't, they won't do a thing for you in that state. Give them to me and I'll have you sorted. Uh, now you gotta get that money so you can buy both Pokemon games when they come out. Understandable. Um, but Liam unfortunately doesn't tend to play on his Switch much anymore. Uh, I've been trying to get him to play Pokemon Unite with me. So far unfruitful. Doesn't have online. <laughs> uh, then please give the Nebu and me the power to dynamite the Pokemon. First we got to battle against the mad Pokemon in the slumbering world and now this. It really feels like we're getting caught up in the adventure of a lifetime. I do understand your excitement young man, but don't get carried away. You want to save your energy for tomorrow's journey. Seems I came back home right in time for all the excitement. Hey you lot, why not have some dinner? You must be hungry, right? I've been totally obsessed with making the latest trendy curries. Where's the fish and chips? I thought this was a British game. It's morning at last and time for adventure to truly start. I'll look into Switch Online when I get home. Fantastic news, friend. I cannot wait. Uh, good morning to you, young challengers. Pop, is it true you really met some Pokemon you didn't recognise? Is there anything more you can tell me about it? Well, there was a weird heavy fog and an even weirder Pokemon appeared. Never tried to fight it off, but then we both passed out or something. It's all pretty hazy. A right fount of information you are. Nebu Hop, these are for you. Uh, you got a Dynamax band from Professor Magnolia, slipped it on your wrist. Ah! Thank you for the follow, Noah. That's so lovely. I'm gonna head out, but it was nice talking to y'all. When do you stream? I uh, do not have a set schedule. I do have a Discord, though. Um. There we go, that might be better. Oh, thanks. Um, so that is probably the best way to check when I'm streaming because I do announce it um, like at least a day or two before uh, just because my work patterns were very irregular so I haven't had a proper streaming pattern yet. I am working on one soon. <laughs> Um, but thank you for the follow. Thank you for coming by today. I appreciate you and I hope you have a lovely day. Uh, thanks, Professor. This is brilliant. It's just like that one Lee has on him, too. Now we can Dynamax some Pokemon like he does. Uh, I bet I guess you... I bet... I, I, yeah, you can't English, can I? <laughs> I guess you better hop... hop <laughs> I guess you better hop to your adventure. That's right. <laughs> My word, you don't waste any time, do you? I think you'll find that it's not so simple as all that. There are a number of conditions you must meet. 
um, if you hope to have your Pokemon Dynamax and take on that gigantic form. Now don't be afraid to go all sorts of places and meet all sorts of Pokemon that will help fill out your Pokedex too. The legend of my reign is finally about to begin. Come on Nebu, I'll beat you to the station. Um... One last thing before we race them, you see I've got some great advice for you. You know how sometimes you see Pokemon wandering out of the tall grass, yeah? If you move real slow like crouch down, those Pokemon will pay you any notice. But on the other hand, if you whistle at them, you'll be sure to catch their attention. If you're a bit rubbish at whistling, just remember this. Need a foil proof trick, fail proof trick, press the left stick. Head out and let's see who can catch the most Pokemon that move. You remember Wedgehurst Station, right? Where we went to pick up Lee before? That'll be a goal, so you see, so see you there. Come at me, Yampa. Don't hate me because you are me. Hate me because you don't want to be. Um, I feel like that's enough. Uh, <sighs> Hefty Chunk grew to level 8. Good on you, hefty chum. Right, um. When I get paralyzed by any other poke, it never actually paralyzes them. Like, I know it says you can be unable to move, or you may be unable to move, but at the same time, I feel like it never paralyzes, you know, so it's a bit like, mm -hmm. I don't know. Hashtag just say it in it. Um, okay. the yampers. Come on, never. You'll never beat me to the station at that pace. <coughs> Man, this child. So out with it, Nebu. How many did you catch? I caught a really special one and you got not one. What were you doing this whole time? You're going to want a team if you're a trainer. You obtain the TM40 Swift. 
star shaped brains. That's a technical machine. With a TM like that, you can teach a Pokemon a new move in the flesh and you can use them again and again too. That one can teach the move Swift. Lee gave it to me ages ago. Now it's yours. Mm. The gym challenge will begin in Motostone. And our train is waiting, so let's go. Let's go, let's go. <laughs> Not quite so fast, you two. What are you doing here, Mum? I knew this day was coming since the moment you chose Grookey as a partner, darling. Professor McNally was kind enough to let us know that you two were set out, so here's a little gift to see you well set on your way. All the kits you'll need for camping. That's so lovely. You put the set of camping gear in your bag's key items. <sighs> no matter what happens if you and your partner are together, I know you'll be fine. Thanks, Mum, and just think how lucky you are. Mother to the first ever pair of Pokemon Brother Trainers Champions. Because I'm certain to be the champion that to be the next champion next, you'll see. Of course you will be, darling. Anyway, do have fun and take care of yourself. She'll be welcome back home anytime. Wish us luck, no doubt we'll need it. My excitement's running ahead of me even faster than the train can go never. Come on, we're off. Mr. Station Master, <laughs> is in this the wild area? What are we stopped here for? Yes, this is the wild area station, make no mistake. I'm sorry to tell you that the train has halted to a flock of Wooloo on the tracks. What's there to be sorry about? This is brilliant. The wild area is massive, there are loads of Pokemon to battle here, you get it, don't you? This is the best possible place to put together. I the greatest team. Nice. Right, let's keep walking. This map is really pretty, by the way. Hi there, would you like to rest your Pokemon? If your Pokemon are even getting a bit fragged out there, set cap and cut them nice meals to have them feeling better in no time. Cute. Right, hop. Look at that. Mmm. That's Motostoke. Way off that way. And between there and here are countless new Pokemon waiting to be met. My gran gave me a proper earful in her own way. Those two young trainers are setting out on a journey, but what are you doing with your life? Ah, never you mind that. Nothing to worry yourself over. Besides, I've been quite curious about that Pokemon you two met in the forest. I've been thinking I should look into it, so the timing works fine. If I discover something really huge, then maybe even gran will admit I've got some talent. Yikes, being an adult hasn't got its own challenges, eh? 
I said you needn't worry about it. I'm glad to be on the road, really. It's been ages. It'll be great fun to fish and camp and rough it outside again. Well, I'm going to stick my head in as many of those red glowing dens as I can find. I'm going to battle the snot out of a bunch of Dynamax Pokemon and fill in another page in the tale of my legend. Damn. Watch Hake. Dynamax Pokemon are really on another level, you know. You'd better Dynamax your partner Pokemon too if you want to take opponents that strong. You'll find spots here and there in the wild uh, area that emit a red beam of light. If you think you're up to it, check them out. There'll be Dynamax Pokemon lurking inside. Uh, so with that, how about I send you off with a little treat from me? You put them. A device that allows you to access Pokemon storage system. There are some places where it won't work. Okay. With a Pokemon box link, you'll be able to put Pokemon from your team into your boxes and take Pokemon from your boxes to add them to your team. Nice, right? <clears throat> so go wild catching as many Pokemon as you like and fill in some of your Pokedex. The wild area is waiting for you. This is the start of your real adventure. It's a bunnelbee! Let's see if we can get Yay! We need to get to level 16 to level up. That's fine. <coughs> uh, no nickname. <gasps> Vanilla! Oh, I accidentally didn't nickname it. Whoopsie. Uh, please select a Pokemon to swap from your party. Um... Yes, swipe her. Flipsy redeemed alpha reveal. Okay. 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 I hear you. I hear you. Uh, today's outfit is, um, sponsored by Uncle. Fuck. Oh, sorry, I had to stretch. So... <laughs> I think it was freeze, wasn't it? Oops. I can't spell today. Let's do it this way. There we go. Right, um... Go back a second. I need to do something.
Um, hey, thank you for that cat. How's work today, baby? What you been up to? Has it been nice and busy? Has it been moderate? I mean, you are here, so I assume it's not the like, busiest. Alright, I need a snack. Deserve a snack. Be moderate to busy. Okay, that's fine. Ooh, Pokemon packs. <laughs> yeah, I have some. Do you want to see what I got from the previous ones? <laughs> Pokemon booster pack opening. All right, let me do that. Um, let me show you what I got then. No. So I actually haven't gotten a lot. So my, I opened three packs, right? In my first one, uh, my reverse was replaced by this shiny, uh, Clubopus. Kind of cute. Kind of weird. But I guess that's Clubopus for you. <laughs> then in my second one, I got a Trapinch. Um, of which I already have two of. <laughs> and then in my third one, uh, I got a shiny Dra Dracovish. Dracovish. Kind of cool. Uh, someone said my name. Hi, Uncle. I'm wearing your clothes today. Well, only your T-shirt. Um, so we had to say your name so that people knew where I got it from. Um, oh, I has that. Oh, do you? That's cool. Um, okay, so uh, do you want to choose which pack I open, or do you just want me to choose? I'm gonna let you if you want to, but if not, I'll just choose the top one. So third. From the left or from the right? That is a nice t-shirt for sure. It's a really nice t-shirt. I really like it. Right. This one. Okay. Man, can I have a snack? One second. I'm meaning to have it for a while now. Right. Da, 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 da. How are you today, Uncle? It's nice to see you on my stream. Ah. Uh. You should still fuck this blue hoodie because only he and I own that colour. Which one? Let me open a pack. Dolly a hoodie. I'm jealous. Oh yeah, where's the waifu flag? Oh, the waifu flag. Um, one second. My waifu flag is, uh, yeah. Oh, no, no, it's a but it. So I just kept him folded. I guess keep going with the skull bunny. There we go. So we, I, I can have my waifu in my chair, right? <laughs> Sounds lap. This is... Yeah, this is exactly... Yeah, this is peak life. <laughs> The flags are crazy big. It is pretty big. But I kind of like it because it makes his head look like, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> fire Pokemon string. We're in the fire team today. Okay, let me, let me do this thing. One, two, three. Top one will be an energy discard. So our bottom one is a little Elder Goss. I really do like Elder Goss. Um, then we have a tropius i don't know how that thing flies those are its wings and it's confirmed cannon that it flies um then we've got ball guy ball guys are from this game aren't they yeah this is an entire set from this game why am i being stupid ball guy is a cool boy i like his face um then we have a yanmar little 
thingy dragonfly? Is that what they are called in British? I don't know. Um, and we've got a regular trapinch just chilling. And very similar to, well, pretty much the same as the um, reverse holographic, obviously. Um, then we've got a nicket. I think that's my third nicket of the day. I'm not angry. Just disappointed. Um, then we have a gossy flower, another one of my beloved little plant babies. Look at the cute little face. <laughs> I love that big flower on its head as well. It's just, it's just beautiful, honestly. Um, all right, not even gonna. And my reverse is a Galarian Weezing. I don't think I have this one. That looks pretty cool. Look at him. Or not, because it won't focus. There we go. Very nice. I do like those little rascals. And my bottom card is unfortunately just a Yan Mega. So, not angry. Do like this, so. Uh, Larry and Weezing card. Very nice card. Uh, gotta shut the shop. Everybody else got COVID. That's a fact. Is it like seven people that had to isolate in your shop? Because, um. What's her face? Gabby and the other boy. I'm really bad with names, I'm really sorry. Anything that requires brain power is just no go for me today. Um, okay. <laughs> Let me play the game for a little bit. Pokemon game in. I'm sorry that you have to do the close today, baby. If it's any consolation. I don't know. You're cute. There we go. Hope that consoles you. Makes everything bad, doesn't it? Galarian Weasiness Poggers. It really is. A very nice card. Loads of vanillite here. Hmm. I need to think for a second. Um, I don't have anyone to invite. Um, splendid top hats, good sirs. They are very lovely, aren't they? Oh, okay. <laughs> oh my god, what a big star buddy. I would pay for one. My spaders. That did not do enough damage to this photo. <clears throat> this is going to be interesting. I 
Lamar drops you. <laughs> Damn, this is what the hell? What is this game? I was hoping it wouldn't go for me. And that's really upsetting. Choose a different Pope or anything. Can't even revive your own Pokemon. This is stupid. Um, I guess I'll just cheer on them. The fat has been a very fucking useless. <laughs> Get into my disco ball. If the premier ball looks this cool, I'd like it. Very creative guys. I think this name really suits it. There we go. Boop boop. Woo! Fuck yeah! Entrapped. Entrapped. I don't know why I'm pronouncing it like that. Enslaved. Whoop! 
I am its Pokemaster. Oh shit, thank you for the follow, Fort Sidorian Pro? Question mark? I think that's how you pronounce it. If it's not, I'm really sorry. How are you today? Um, let's swap General Chub out. Okay, I've done a Dynamax. Am I a pro gamer now? On to like. Oh, it's a Diggersby. Yeah, I remember. Can I fight you? Love to cook, you've come to the right place. I've got all the finest ingredients in here pasta, fried food, tins of noodles, tin of beans, mixed mushrooms. Backs. Putin. Mm. Let's get some instant nudes. Yeah, 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 just one cup. Give us another visit tomorrow, now nah, lad. Right. Another diggers bee. Let's run away from the diggers bee. I don't know if I can actually like do anything to it. You found a note. Did someone drop it here? Use the right stick to rotate the camera while you're in the wild area. And if you press the right stick, you'll find you can see a wider view of things. Press the L button to look straight ahead again. Ah. Where's Pancham? I want a Pancham. I know you can get one here. Oh! Snover. Let's go, Flare. Let's double kick it. Let's see. I'll get it low. Uh, and then I'll uh, capture it. Wait! <laughs> oh no. That was beautiful. Saved by a little itty bitty titty committee. Um, let's use a Pokeball on him now. Oh no, the Pokemon broke free. Right, let's try again. One last Pokeball, if this doesn't work, then I'll just kill it. Kill it. Why are you like I prefer using so hard though? I mean I'm just gonna fight you now, there's no point. All as well, guys. We caught the Snova. Just need a level and a half for the Scarlet Eagle so we can. I think it will evolve. I'm not sure. Would be nice. Would be nice to get that done today. Um. Okay. 
tone boy. Oh no, I keep pressing the wrong button because I'm on a Nintendo console. Uh, Alright, let's just send him to a box. Alright, what's that? Ah! Is this the full? I don't really have a lot of uh, health points, I just realised, so this is going to be an interesting fight. Yeah, I expected that. Oh, okay. Thank you for the gifts, Sabitabi. You don't have to do that, you know that, right? And thank you very much, I really appreciate it. Um, I think... Buddy. <laughs> I think one more and I'm actually gonna get a Twitch payout next month. So I'm just gonna keep streaming at least until I get like enough for that stupid Twitch um, payout. So I appreciate it, it really does help. Uh, let's try and capture this boy. Get this money. <laughs> <laughs> um, oops, I keep pressing the wrong buttons. Uh, uh, let's just do a bite. That's all I can afford now. No, 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 don't worry. Don't be silly. I'm just saying, as a goal for today, one more sub, y'all. Thanks. <laughs> um, right. Oh, fuck. Flare fainted, so we got nothing out of this. Right, let's uh, revive some poke and heal him up. And stuff. Oh, Flipsy, no, it's okay. Oh, that ditto! What is that ditto? It's a beautiful ditto. Stuffles, that I will be added to the Pokédex. Would you like to give Stuffle a name? Yes. Where do you want to send the where? Put him in my party. Um, Wulu, sorry, mate. Are you okay, there, Flops? Are you having a moment? Oh, there's something cool. Get away. Um. Okay, so let's have a little camp. Can I heal a poke? Yeah, just finding all the sad emojis. I'm so sorry. Don't be sad. Be happy. You're mad cute. Never be sad. Sorry, let me fix up my husband. Why is it good? 
<laughs> Don't we look cute? <laughs> Um, I'm not sad, just enjoying myself with <laughs> this. That's fine, that's fine. Each to their own. Put your heart to it. Right. Let's hope this food doesn't taste like arse just because I put my heart into it. Done! Your instant noodle curry. Pokemon was with the Hey, my scar bunny. Right, let's take out a toy. Yeah, the scar bunny is always. Yes! Go get it. Oh, go get it. Go get it, boy. Go get it. Oh. Further. This is adorable. Go get it, guys. <laughs> Where is the? What are you doing? <laughs> no one cares about it. No. I. What is he doing? <laughs> what a beautiful, happy boy. Thank you, baby. Right. That's enough for now. <laughs> Alright, let's check this 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 uh let's check this clip out. It better be good flops. <laughs> Don't we look cute? <laughs> uh, okay, break over. Oh, it's fine, it's fine. Thank you, 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 thank you. Thank you. Um, have fun, boo. I hope work's not Don't too we look bad. cute? I'll miss you. Bye. <laughs> right, that's a, that's a good clip. Um. Da -da 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 -da. I wanted to send it to the Discord. Um. Right. Um. Let's keep doing this. Let's keep doing stuff. Let's. Uh... <sighs> okay. So I need to. I can't do Dynamax stuff. Is this? Have I got this? Yeah, I do. Don't have the oddish though. Let's get the oddish. Hello, you beauty pie. Do you want to capture it though? Uh, shit. So I'm gonna try an amber. I think that might be better. Oof. I did nothing. Oh. Use the potion. Poison powder. Alright, please don't do action damage, just poison. That's fine. Let's use a normal potion. We got this, we got this. Oh, 
Right. Emma! Drain. But it heals it up. Ember. Blaze Ember. Woo! Right. Then I have to use Ember one more time, I think, before I can. Uh... Yeah, it's gonna like kill it. Let me see if I can find this Pokemon. Probably won't work. Let's hope. Yeah, I thought so. Poison powder. The flare is already poisoned. He's losing a lot of HP. So this is Oddish. So if I do bag, poison, he's, uh, potion, he's just like, oh. This must be a really sad battle to watch. I just really want the Oddish because I think Oddish is mad cute. Please, no hate. Damn, acid is the one thing that I don't want it to use. Because whenever he uses acid, I do want to take a lot of damage. So Oddish will use acid and it will finish me off, right? Well, as Oddish is feeling generous. Okay. 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 Uh, what if I throw my Pokeball now? I am dead here though. Yep. One, two, three, four, five. I should take six. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Please, Oddish, let me capture you. That'll be so nice. Let's be friends. Let's be friends. Yes! Oh, this makes me so happy. Oh. Oh, okay. Oddish's data will be added to the Pokédex. It's a weed Pokémon. Uh, would you like to give Oddish a nickname? I'm very original. Where do you want to cinch 420 to? Let's bring it to the party. Uh, and I want it to replace the... Water is important. I mean, the only one it can kind of replace is Boop Boop. So, fuck Boop Boop. 420 is gonna take your place, friend. Right, um. I need to. revive. Pokeball, only one Pokeball left.
Let's see. The Galvantula there. There's a Chateau. Stuffles, Oddishes. Ooh, hello! Don't think I have you yet, Bonesy. Bonesy. <laughs> it's so cute. Um, okay, so if we use an amber, maybe I'll do something. Okay, amber did stuff. Hmm. So now I need to try and just like not do too much damage. <laughs> Sad. Okay. Right. So, can I just collect the watts? Right. My bad. I don't know how to fish in this game. <laughs> right, let's just collect some watts and, uh,. What's a ball sweet? Hello? <laughs> Love it. It's so cute. Okay. Sit back on my husband there. Right, so we need to uh, try Ember. Right, this time Ember did less. Ah, uh, it's because it's a. Uh, Uh, can we do a quick attack, I think. Okay, then we'll do one more quick attack and then we'll throw my last healthy ball on it. Oh wait, I think I already- oh no, yeah, I have one. Alright. <laughs> See if it will let me catch it. Hey, we got it! That's amazing. That makes me so happy. Um, that's so cool. I don't know. Can I like get any more pokes? Um, let's see. Would you like to give Bound Sweet a nickname? Yes. And I name it Beet. Because it looks like a beetroot. Beet. Where do you want to send Beet to? A box. Cool. Where's the pan jumbo? It's not like it matters when I get a Pancham because I don't have a bloody um uh oh um don't have any pins so I guess I'm gonna go in do this bit and then I'll come back out with some Pokeball. Oh, there's people here. Do you sell Pokeballs? Heal ball, wishing piece, a low kick, 
our entire car mode. What does hydro pump do? Tug gets blasted with huge volume of water. Oh, these are like uh, thingy majiggies. That's cool. <gasps> I want to change my tent color. Oh my god. Someone please help me. Right. There we go. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Stop. Right, my Cretex. Three packs of sausages. I love a good sausage meat. That's cool. I appreciate the sausage. Okay, let's let's get out of here. There go up. She going. She going. So pretty. I want a Nintendo. <gasps> Sonia. Ah, beautiful woman. I feel like whenever you like this game everyone just throws dialogue at you and it's like please Taking me out. Oh. She a thing. I do admit. Right. Let's press my pokey pokes. Bye. Oh, thank you for the follow, Panther Onka. I hope that's how you pronounce it. How are you doing today? Are you a Pokemon fan? Uh, a fellow gamer, can I ask? <laughs> what do you mean up to today? I hope life's been treating you well. Let's play. Let's buy some potions. And let's buy five revives if I can. No, I can only buy three. That's fine. Good evening. I still remember Pokemon since I was eight. Hey, that's great. Um, I assume you're all about older than eight now. 
So, what game have you played from the first generation? Damn. Okay, so you, did you start with, I assume? Well, I was just actually, no. Um, what game did you start with? Let's use the card maker. Let's make my own card. Um, background. Okay, well, you can't make a background like this and it's not expect me to use it, so... I like this as well. What is this? Oh, this is nothing. Okay. Yep. I'm sorry, everyone. Nothing else matters. <laughs> um. Can I? <coughs> uh oh. Um. I accidentally. Oh, you know what? I like it. Uh, I used to play in a past that Pokemon Fire Red. Okay, Fire Red, not a bad choice. And uh... okay. I don't need you. Um, so kind of do maths now, right? Twenty. 23 years of Pokemon. That's a long time for one video game. Um, you know, that's kind of how old I am though. <laughs> so, um, I've only started with this game, unfortunately. No, this game, sorry, I lied. Uh, I started with X when I was 19, so like four years ago. Because uh, 3DS was my first ever Nintendo console that I had. Uh, I bought it for myself uh, to play Fire Emblem. Um, I feel like people that are watching this from the beginning are getting tired of me repeating it. <laughs> um, and uh, I, I enjoyed Pokemon, but I was mainly owning my 3DS to play through the Fire Emblem game, so I didn't get like, uh, properly into Pokemon. Uh, and then now I got. Uh, I got a Switch to play Monster Hunter and then I ended up buying Let's Go Eevee and I'm obsessed with Pokemon since, so rip. Uh, Pokemon X was released in 2016 if I'm not wrong, you could very much be right. Um, it was quite expensive when I got it so I guess it would make sense it was only a year old. Um, but it was a really good game. Um, I miss it. I want to play through all of the games as a mind. It would be lovely to have a chance to do that, but, you know. Um, I'll get there. Uh, about Monster Hunter games, I play Monster Hunter World. I play World on PC, uh, and I also play Rise on the Switch. I was gonna get stories, but I ended up not getting enough, getting through enough of Rise. To warrant purchasing the November Monster Hunter game. I am currently on a Pokemon obsession, so I just can't Pokemon it, isn't it? <laughs> uh, so I need to wait. Then on a console to play Rise. I need to wait for next year to come on PC. Okay, so you don't have a. So you've not played through um, Let's Go Eevee and Sword and Shield, then have you? Uh, I'd surely never make it to the stadium without you to show me the way, partner. Even with a huge old thing like this bang in the middle of the city, I still get lost. Never, alright. One look tells me that you've become a trainer worthy of that endorsement I gave you. And yes, I reckon you might even be ready to use this. Here, try giving this to your partner to hold. A piece of charcoal. You can take that lift up to the city's upper level if you headed to the stadium next. Okay. Oh, I didn't get level 16. Rip. That's fine. Right. Oh, look at this cool ball guy! Ta-da! You took the time to talk to Pokeball, so you deserve a little reward. I'll take it. <laughs> Thank you, Pokey guy. They call me Deepo, the bowl guy. Cute. Okay. Ooh, hop. 
Hello friend. You made it to Motterstoke Stadium. This is where the opening ceremony will be held. Um He got Pokeball head and a buff body, so he does doesn't he? He is a buff daddy Pokeball. <laughs> um Everyone will be watching the opening ceremony for the gym challenge. My mum, your mum, the whole world. Yes, my mum and your mum is pretty much the whole world. So it's getting me a bit nervous, Brady. Nah, this isn't nerves. I'm only trembling because I'm so excited. Come on, Nebu, it's the time the world learns our names. This guy's so like excited to do literally anything and everything. It's kind of cute. <laughs> right. Okay, well, Mr. Panthera, since you know all the Pokemon, which is your favourite and why? Get inside up. Oh, I remember this kid. <clears throat> he was on a pokey card. Um, seriously, what a piece of work. <clears throat> if you're here to register for the pokey gym, you'll need to see your endorsement, please. Um, well, as you can see, my nickname, I'm a cat person. Okay, I thought you were just into the band, but... <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm so attached to the first gen mostly. It's understandable. Um, is it going to be as obvious as like meow? So if I should pick a favorite, it would be without any to Persian and meow. Yeah, I thought so. Uh, no, that's a good choice. Meow is uh, quite high on my um, quite high on my list. But unfortunately, it's because of the anime more than anything else. I do think meow is a good character. No animated so yeah um no that's a good choice i mean like my i think my favorite is yeah my favorite is from the first gen as well um is the it's a cute little bubble gum um not quite kirby but could be if it wanted to <laughs> uh, the good old jigglypuffly um i know i always liked how it like made everyone fall asleep and it didn't realise that it's doing it. It just thinks that people just go to sleep because they're rude and then it draws on them. I think that's a mood. <laughs> um, so yeah, that that would be my choice. <laughs> uh, Jigglypuff in the anime was so sweet, I remember it. <laughs> it was very sweet, very cute. Um, I fancy that this is the first time we've had a challenger endorsed by the champion. Well, now you've had two because I am as well. What, two of you at once? I wonder what's come over Leon this year. The two of you must be something special. Okay, okay, okay. I'm special, I'll take it. I'm Hop, I'm Leon's little brother, in fact, and the next champion. Get me all signed up, would you? Well, yes, I am trying to, if you'll just give me a moment. Yeah. Uh, after turns the microphone into a pencil and I'm super not. Surprise! Yes! Throw all the wheelies. Wheelies? Willies. <laughs> I love it. It's so cute. Um, okay, so I need to enter your uniform number. Will I be this person? Will I be this person? Yes, I will be this person. Number 69 is it? Very well. <laughs> uh, leaving away good memories on the face of everyone going to sleep after listening to this song. <laughs> it's such a cute song though as well. Oh man, I missed it. Uh, and here, please wear this challenge band at all times to identify yourself as a <sighs> gym challenger. The opening ceremony for the gym challenge is to be held here tomorrow. All the trainers taking part have been booked a room at the nearby but you drop in. That's the league chair before you even book us all hotel rooms. I'm off to check out the fancy things. Um, a key song, sadly, with the collateral effect that makes people sleep. I mean, this is just, I don't mind sleeping. Sleeping's cute. So, don't worry. Um, it's just, it happened, didn't it? 
I was endorsed by the chairman himself, in other words, a mongol who's elite enough to get an endorsement, I'm the most elite of all, so why don't you clear off and tr not try talking to me again? I'm positively criminal of you wasting- this is positively criminal of you wasting the time of someone as important as I am. What a douche. Let's all do our utmost as gym challenges. <gasps> oh! Guys, is Oh! It's more Paco, guys. <laughs> Marnie is waifu material. I don't care what anyone says. Uh, there are heaps of us starting out like this, but only small number will make it to the end. Damn. Mm, so everyone here is a fellow gym challenger. Yes, we're all challenged. Right, I think I spoke to everyone. Where's the hotel? Oh, you must be challenging Nebu. Thank you for approaching me, man. I was going to get lost. Yeah. I think thinking of the Jigglypuff song has made me a little bit sleepier than it should have. Uh. Uh, it would be cool one day to see a Pokemon game with the graphic style of the movie. Oh! It would. I admit, it would. But, I don't know. Can Nintendo handle that, do you think? Like, it would be massive. I don't know if it would be available for a Switch, you see. It might have to be something, like, completely different. Uh, hey, it looks like you've both got yourself registered. Um... What's this then? The statue of the hero who once saved the Galar region. I could run through the legend right quick if you fancy. Give me all the details. Long ago, a great black storm covered the Galar region. People called it the darkest day. The land was assaulted by gigantic Pokemon, but they were defeated by a single young hero bearing a sword and shield. This statue here is meant to depict the young hero of that legend. We still don't understand what kind of sword and shield the hero actually had and what this black storm is supposed to be is just another mystery. Whatever it was, it blotted out the skies all across Gala. I suppose that tracks with it being called the darkest day, but still. I suppose the hero must have been about as strong as lead and looks like you're going to have your hands full with plenty of two research though, Sonya. Black storms and swords and shields and all. You'll be alright, Sonya. Heh, <laughs> thanks. I'll model through somehow, don't you worry. Uh, well, not really the same due to the fact that poly count on the one in game models must have a lower amount of polygons than the film to do. Um, I'd like to see that someday. Hey, hello, my soap. How you doing? Um, it would be pretty cool, but it would be. I don't know. <sighs> It's not like impossible, it's just, it's a lot, and like, if we think about it, like, Nintendo doesn't tend to cater to the graphics, does it? So, it might be something that's, um, I don't know, maybe for the future, or maybe they'll do something for PC, or very unlikely, very unlikely, but it would be nice to have some Pokemon PC games. <laughs> um... How are you, Musou? So? What have you been up to today? Are you a fellow Pokemon master? I call myself a master <laughs> with um, But Nintendo Graphic can support with our problems Monster Hunter Rise, so a movie like Pokemon stylized game with fur shader and various maps would totally be affordable. Rise isn't that graphically advanced though, is it? Uh, something for the Switch Ultra. Switch Ultra is a myth, isn't it? What's the problem with those guys? I can't check in. What's the deal with this team yell? I can't check in. We came all the way out to this big thing so that we could properly cheer on gym challenges. Team yell is here to help after all. You're in for a battle if you want to stop us. 
I'm up for that. Um, well, for a small console, Rise of Graphics is very nice. Yeah, 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 definitely. Don't get me wrong. I'm not saying Rise of Graphics is not nice. Uh, and it is a lot better than, like, PSP tiles and, um, like, what I've seen previously made. I know, I, I don't want to compare it to World, because World is a completely different game, um, as it catered to masses and literally, like, compatibility with all consoles and PC, like, platforms, sorry. Uh, oh, no, there's a Switch. But, um, like... I don't know. I just... It would probably take a lot, but... It... I, yeah. Um... The world's graphics may look better because of some extra shading. <coughs> we want to make sure she gets chid on nice and proper and now you're gonna help us. Make some noise. I forgot these bastards have to do dudes. Um, okay, level 9. Let's use a double kick. Okay. Uh, but analyzing the model, will Basil Geese and Vice Basil Geese, for example, do own the same model? I do they? I did not know that. Oh, I defeated it. Oh, that's that's pathetic. Um, maybe it isn't as as difficult as I thought it would be, but I just yeah. <sighs> I don't, don't want to get my hopes up. If that makes sense. Uh, of course, I've got you covered, mate. What would be better than a battle in a lovely hotel lobby? What is with these games? Ooh, she's got a Marnie flag. Forgot about that. Where's my Marnie flag? Why did my game not come with a Marnie flag? Alright, fight this naked. Quick attack. No quick attack. A got knocked on my double kick. Boom. Headshot. It's super effective. The Pokemon was one hit. The opposing thingy fainted. Right. I must have got a bit carried away being this swanky hotel and all. Sorry for getting in your way. That was... Hoppy, you're not helping. Let's have a two on two. Um, so basically, yes, better particles, a first shader, and more lightning effects are missing in Rise instead of World. Also, due to the face, it's a console game, even the texture's resolution standing has a lower quality. Okay, 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 okay. You seem to know a lot about um, what goes into designing video games. Uh, the max res for most of the world is 2k, and rise the highest brace texture, maybe 1k res. Huh. Uh, okay, let's fight. Double kick. Nick it. Wicked that. I'm explaining about this also because making video games graphics is like Oh, okay! That's a good job you have. It's a good job you came and taught me about things a little bit. Um, I feel like I kind of get it. Probably don't. We'll see. <laughs> um, actually working on a new video game made in the UK. Can you reveal anything about it? Or is there any NDA? Um, let's just tackle this thing, dude. 
<coughs> Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Um, ah, oh, thank you for the follow, Masaru. Can you the world to me? Uh, hope you're well. And don't be afraid to talk. Obviously, it won't fault you, but I feel scared, don't be. We're all friendly here. My voice isn't sure when I'm sad. I wanna yell, but I'm not sure. Uh, well, my company doesn't like spoilering too much about. Okay, what company do you work for then? That's all I need to know. Is it Ooh, thank you for the follow, Robo Gamer. How are you today? I don't think I've seen you before. Um, are you a fellow Pokemon master? Who is your favourite Pokemon if you ever played any of the games? Uh, and if not, nice to have you here. Maybe I can convince you to get this game. Uh, what are you lot doing here? Marnie? <laughs> Look at her, she's glorious. So beautiful. Okay, Marnie will be the reason I dye my hair black in the next month. <laughs> um, it's still a farming company at the moment, but we are preparing our first game. Is it Cloud Imperium? Like that's the only one that I know that isn't like. Oh wait, no. Well, I mean, um, Star Citizen's been a. In like is it data for absolute years so yeah um one I'm good and yes I'm a fellow Pokemon master nice what's your favorite poke what do you usually choose uh if given a choice obviously um the name will be iron compass games okay that sounds pretty cool and like how long ago have you joined them Uh, they're just so caught up with wanting to support me and all that they tend to get a bit shirty with other <laughs> gym challenges. Sorry if they caused you any trouble. So you're a gym challenger too. Team Yell was it pretty impressive that you already have a set of fans to call your own. This more Paco is mad cute. Right. I guess we probably should head to the front desk and get checked in. You are at the front desk, you sausage. Um, I joined in 2017, so four years ago. And what's like coming of the game? How, how do you like, um, how do you, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. How do you, how do you, how do you, how do you, like, how deep into it all are you guys? How must how how much have you finished? Do you guys have everything like planned and is everything like going smoothly or um how do you choose a favourite Pokemon overall? I can't decide. No, that I know it's a stupidly hard question because if you ask me on a different day I will have different answers. Um especially now that I've actually played the games, like the more recent games and I've discovered new Pokemon along the way, like if you asked me three years ago, I would have said Jigglypuff. If you asked me today, I will list you 700 different Pokemon that I will like too much. <laughs> um, we're close to have a demo of the game. Ooh, between October and December. That's cool. Um, and what platforms is the game going to be on? You must be one of the Pokemon trainers entering a gym challenge. And what kind of a game is it? Um, well, I have a lot of favourite Pokemon, but I can say the cutest one is a Rain... 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 Oh my god. Runiclus? And its shiny form is amazing. I don't think I've ever seen the shiny form. One moment. I'm gonna do a cheeky Google. Oh, yes! I remember this beauty. Um... Um,
Okay. Um, no, that's a good choice. That's a unique choice. Uh, not unique. Well, I mean, it is a lot, but... So, like... <sighs> With, like, the release of Sword and Shield, there was a lot of really cute Pokemons announced. Uh... So like Sword and Shield have really broken me because I can't choose an actual like favourite because there's like so much like I really like El Creamy and I really like um oh, what it was called now. Um or Peko. Uh but I've just the Zian pad, there's just too many honestly. Um but yeah, no, I understand that it's a silly question to ask, especially as there are more games that I'm about to, to choose from, so yeah. <laughs> um, okay. Uh, also, the game will be a platform-like RPG. You don't play as a human character, but you control a whole ship. Uh, a bit like a very old PlayStation 1 PC game named Overboard. I do not think I've ever heard of Overboard. That sounds pretty cool. Um, this sounds nice in fact. Uh, morning! So this is it. Now my legend really begins. Watch out, Nebu. I'll beat you to Motostoke Stadium. This kid just wants to race and race. Uh, Rony Close is from Pokemon Black and White, but I still love it. I think it's available in Sword and Shield, though, is it not? Don't hate me. Gym Challenger, the opening ceremony is done soon. Please allow me to escort you to the gym stadium. I played overboard as younger and I found it very fun. Well, that's it's good that you joined the team that's working on something similar to it, I guess. It's only found in Pokemon Shield. So yeah, okay. Um that's cool. So that's That's good because I have shield. Whoops. I went the wrong way, guys. Please bear with. Direction. I'm like Leon. Directions are really not my thing. Right. This is my first gym. I've played for four hours and this is my first gym. Um, that's bad because I don't have shield. I have sword as well, but I um, gave my copy to sword to a friend to complete it. Because I was more interested in getting through shield. And we were going to just exchange pokes. <clears throat> to be fair, so I don't have to play through the other one. 69! Look at that beautiful number I picked. Woo! And that's 69 uh, That really is the number for you. Down right, boy. Um... Oof. <laughs> right. This is exciting. Whoops. Almost dropped my pad. Um, I think if I really have to decide from Gen 8, I'd probably like Top Cell Line though. Top Cell Line. I don't know what that is. And... Okay, um... I'm really like uneducated. Is it Top Cell? I don't like not knowing, so I'm just going to Google anything and everything that. And now you're ready for battle, bro. I've been born ready. <laughs> uh, but that yes, that stretch really did help me. Thank you. Here's the fighting farmer, grass type expert, Milo. A raging wave is the master of water types, and Nessa, she's so beautiful. Ever been in front of fire? Here comes the fire veteran, Kaboo. 
Silent boy of mystery, Alistair, friend to ghost types. Cutie pie. Master of fantastic theatre is the chairman fairy type user, Opal. The ice cold professional, please welcome the ice type master, Melanie. And last but not least, the tamer of dragons, it's Raihan, the top gym leader. Unfortunately, we are missing one, but these are the gym leaders that we in the Galar region are proud to call our own. Um, oh my god, all the trainers in the one catwalk. It was so cute, wasn't it? They're like, ooh. The very hand's name resembles too much Raffian. It does, doesn't it? I was thinking, I was breathing, I was like, ooh, okay. Um, but no, it's cool. It's cool. All is good. Standing there on the pitch in the stadium in front of everyone, there's really no words for it, but I can barely contain myself. My heart is racing. You've made it at last, Hop. And you too, Nebu. So you're the two trainers our champion endorsed himself. Welcome, it's a delight to meet you. I am Rose, of course. And oh, what's that? I see you both already possess Dynamax bands. How wonderful. It seems you two have been led here by the guiding light of the wishing star. Um, by the way, it was my wonderful company that invented those Dynamax bands, you know. I dare say this year's gym challenge is looking to be an absolute blast. Very good, very good indeed. That means the whole Galar region is in for some excitement. The gym challenge is an excellent opportunity to show off your Dynamax Pokemon. Now I am terribly sorry, but there is some urgent business I need to attend to, so I must be on my way. Best of luck to both of you. This guy just sounds like a villain, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> um... Also, his colors are mainly red, black, and very brown. Hmm. Fact. Um, and the missing gym leader is Pierce, and he's a dark gym leader. Okay. Pierce. I feel like I remember him. He may be this guy's baffless and human. <laughs> he is! Wait, you mean, um... You mean, you mean Rose is a bad boy? Uh, the chairman sentence certainly seems to be in high spirits. Now listen closely, you two. You've uh, both only just started your path as trainers. If you want to win, you need to do more than just train your Pokemon. You need to train yourselves too. I ain't going to the gym. Let's do it, Nebu. You know the gym challenge has a set order that you've got to visit the gyms in, right? The first is in Turfield. And to get there, we need to head to Route 3. I mean, you could gather that Rose is not a very good guy. His, like, endorsement guy is a dickhead as well. Sorry for swearing. And he didn't sound very polite. He was, like, just talking like a thief. Um, one second. Where to find? I'm gonna quickly Google where to find my favorite Pokemon. Route 6. Cool. Okay. I feel like we've still got a while before I get to it, but it's fine. Not disappointed, sad or anything. Um... Challenger Nebu, the chairman asked me to deliver this gift to you. A gift, such a wonderful thing, from the chairman, such a wonderful man. <laughs> Excuse me, the gift is access to the flying taxis. They allow you to, in a word, fly. Colin, a flying taxi will allow you to travel quickly back to areas you've already visited. Um, that's cool. Uh, he's doing the thing for a good cause, but the Pokemon that is storing all the energy is getting more power by the second and it can possibly destroy the world. Okay, I feel like that's a bit of a spoiler, but you know what? That's fine. Um, means I'm looking forward to something. <laughs> uh, go, Gym Challenger. 
Oh, I like how they point you in the right direction by putting people in the way of the other direction. That's really nice. Cute touch. Um, I'm just going to rest my parrots before I leave, just to make sure I don't accidentally kill them. I don't want to say anymore since you will see it near the end of the game. Well, I am at the beginning of the game, so I still have a while to go. Uh, but I'm excited. Right. We hope to see you again. You might as well. Right. Oh, hop for goodness sake. There you are, I've been waiting. Let's have a battle. You and me will get a bit of training. I knew you'd do it. We've got to stay keener than anyone else if we want to steal the spotlight from our rivals. You have a decent team though. Uh, they're okay. I will end up just using the score button just to let you all know. Guys, mine. Play style. <laughs> uh, hop sets out. Wooloo. Keep up, mate. This is our chance to see if we are up to the gym challenge. Alright. Double game. I hate fighting this child, because he never wins. A completed story with just two Pokemon. Uncle Charm! How you doing? Um... I mean, I practically completed Let's Go Eevee with just Eevee, so I'm doable. Uh, rip little sheep with braids. <laughs> yeah, poor Wooly. Ooh, Claire got level 16 though. Does that mean it's gonna evolve now? Or do I have to trigger an evolution on it? Ember. Pow. It's super effective. This is making me want to play Unite. Um, I I want to play Unite as well. I will get to it soon. Uh, yeah, to battle it will evolve. Thank you, gamer. Uh, should an all move be forgotten? Yes. Uh. Nervous to eat berries. I don't understand that part, but I'm just going with it. Alright. Uh, you want to battle and your entire team got experience? That's like impressive. Yeah, this game was uh, doing an experience share, which is nice. Yeah. I'll do it. I also want to try playing Unite, uh, although it's so far from the actual Pokemon. Yes, it is very far from it. However, it is a perfect game for people like me that like uh, mobiles, because I used to play quite a bit of Dota. Uh, then moved more into League of Legends as that's what most of my friends play. Um, and now I just hate the League community. So uh, having a bit of a chill from that is nice. Uh, Savannah the Bunny! Oh, thank you so much for the follow. How are you today? Are you also a Pokemon gamer? Uh, I see that makes a lot of sense. <laughs> um, Um, yeah, like, I just, yeah, um, it's like a squad battle game that is based with basketball, but I like the game for its best game. Okay, okay. Uh, I never played League of Legends, a lot of people say it was too toxic. It is, the community can be kind of be toxic. But, like, the worst thing is, because I've played it so long, and, like, most of my play friends play it, like, old friends play it, I just... I go back into it more for the social aspect and honestly like 
I, I'll go like two months without playing it and then I'll play it exclusive, exclusively, yes, exclusively for like a week and then I'll hate myself. Uh, <laughs> oh shit, score money's evolving! Woo! Go Flare. Sorry, I'm just excited. Um, you have the same star Pokemon as I have. Hey, that's amazing! How, how deep into the game are you? How much have you played of it? Are you enjoying it so far? I really hope you are. Uh, and what other pokes do you have in your team? <laughs> uh, uh, like really a lot of them told me. Yes, League is not very nice unfortunately. Um, but it's fine because it's just video games isn't it? Like um, Fortnite has a shit community. Uh, the game is probably not as bad as I think it is but because of the community I just can't play it basically. Um, and it's it's the same with some other games as well, so you know. Um, I never understood League because at that point there were already 1,000 champs with 2,000 items. Yes, League is very much a game that you have to d dwell into uh, because every patch changes quite a bit. So if you're not on top of it, you're not going to enjoy it because you're not going to know what to do and what, how to build. So I understand that it's 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 a game of dedication. So uh, I'm the champion. Oh, have you finished the game? Um, Reboot data will be added to the Pokédex. He only weighs twenty pounds. God bless him. <laughs> Um, Raboot, aka Hoodie Hair. I know, I was thinking, like, he's gone from a cute little scar buddy to this. He's, he's, he's in his fucking teenage angst years, isn't he? <laughs> uh, didn't play Fortnite either. That's fine. I only played it twice uh, and I hated it, so yeah. Uh, right now, who I have on my team? I have Nolan Chameleon, Milotic, Shiny Eevee, and Cinderace. You have a Shiny Eevee! That is amazing! Um,. I'm jealous. Uh, I'm my shiny look in any game is absolute garbage. <laughs> so, um, yeah, but it's fine. Um, I'll just bully my friends into giving me some shinies. <laughs> um, okay. Ooh, let's play this game. God damn it. Um, I've watched some gameplay of my country streamers playing Fortnite since of swear words and personal insults to people killing them. Yeah, um, okay, so I used to, well, I played a little bit of, um, Mordhau. It's, a uh, medieval hack and slashing where you're supposed to fight other people, basically. It is a really cool game, but the community is so toxic in it. Everyone is flowing racial slurs at each other. It's it's really weird like it hurts me because i want to play the game but like tip like 20 minutes of it can be too much for me just because of that um <gasps> pussy plus so um yeah um a little edgy but just as cute when he gets embarrassed when he smiles in the other way <laughs> <laughs> all right um i can't say no to that uh will a quick attack be okay I want to capture this. Oh, did did nothing. Um, so not what I think you can play for me. No, I get that, I get that, don't worry. Um, Call of Duty Warzone is toxic. I, this is, I don't play shooters for this, for that exact reason. I feel like too many, um, uh, too many shooting games tend to be, um, To like tend to have toxic communities, so I tend to avoid them. Uh, World of Warcraft is toxic too. It can be. I've not played World of Warcraft for a while now, though. Uh, Pokemon Online battles are toxic. I heard the toss the TCG can be bad. I've not played the TCG ones online, um, but I wanted to get into it. But like, I've been hearing some like not good things said about that, so... Ugh. Gossy Flare's data will be added to the Pokedex. Would you like to give Gossy Flare a nickname? Does anybody want to name my Gossy Flare? That was your chance whilst I have a drink. Okay. 
go, Savannah. You deserve her for free. And where would you like to name it? Uh, but I see the most toxic game communities are the ones that involve PvP. Yes, definitely. It's because it's because of the salt level when someone else is better than you or someone gets lucky or something. It's just, you know, Rose. Rose is a nice name. Yes, let's give it a nice little nickname. Rose. Um... Don't think Rose is part of my party for the end game, but I know Yampa definitely is, so I'm gonna keep Rose in my party until I need to replace it with something else. Um, should we blame the games themselves? No, it's the people's fault if they take the game too seriously. Exactly that. You have to learn that it's just a game, mate. Chill. Take a take a chill pill. Uh, Growlithe. Uh, I can't come up with anything else. Don't worry about it. Rose is a lovely name. Um, why not Rosebud? Oh, that's fair. <laughs> Too late now. Sorry, guys. I can catch another though. Um, Rob, if you want. Oh, shit. He's asleep. I forgot to wake him. Rob, if you want to, you can name my next Pokemon I catch. Um, let me. Awakening. Right. You can change it. Can you? I thought you can't after you change it. Do I have to go to the guy? I don't think I can go to the guy right now to change it. But I can go to him at some other point later. Um. I hate this, but it's gonna heal. Whoops. Yeah, where well, you go to heal, you worry, uh, Pokemon man on the left. Yeah, 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 I know that guy. I know of him. Uh, I'll do it there whenever, when I'm next. Uh, um, even in the old game, you were able to name change your Pokemon to an NPC with, like, a Pokemon with him. Yeah, yeah, he's got an Indeedee, that's the Pokemon name. Uh, I only know that because I have really like Indeedee, so... Oh my god, I'm doing absolutely no damage here. No, I don't it. Was it to earlier, shouldn't I? Uh, please. Okay. Um, I'm gonna heal and then I'm gonna use a potion ball just in case. Um, it will say the rate this name or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, uh, it will tell you. He basically tells you how good the name is that you have given that you're choosing for it. Uh, but yeah. yeah. Okay, so, um, let's try throwing a Pokeball and see if it works. In Pokemon Fire Edge, has a fat bald man sprite, kind of hilarious. That sounds pretty cool. I do want to play the original games. I will get there. Um, just not yet. <laughs> I'm going through the, um, Switch titles first, then I'm gonna go back and I'm gonna emulate uh, and play on stream the originals upwards. In the Pokemon Center, and if you go to the guy on the left, yes, 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 I forgot his name, but yeah, I remember that you can do it there. So I watched someone play this game before. Oh, okay, uh, forget an old move. Stun Spore, Sweet Scent, Poison Powder, Acid, Mega Drain. Okay. Ta-da! 420 forgot Sweet Scent, and it learns Stun Spore and Sped. Stuff. <clears throat> okay, Rob, would you like to name this Growlithe? Uh, if it's still up on Google Play Store, there is the first Pokemon Red App completely emulated. Oh, uh, like the first ever game, gen game ever. I think they are all available on PC. Um, so I'm gonna try see if that works. Uh, if it doesn't, then I'm going to just try. <laughs> uh, I'll find a different way, basically, but you know. Um, sure. Give me a good name for this good boy. 
Doesn't he look like a good boy? But there are some ads in it, and honestly, adding so many ads makes me want to quit the game. Name it Tiger. Okay, I'm gonna do Tiger with as many R's as it lets me put. Is that too many? Would you like me to delete two? Uh, hmm, a good name for it. Let me think. What about Tora? No, it's perfect. <laughs> okay. Uh, well, this one was Rob's, uh, but if you want to, you are more than welcome to name the next Pokemon I catch. Uh, first gonna stay. Beware, don't beware. <clears throat> I don't really want to use beware. So we'll add Tiger. <laughs> Um, okay, so all the glossy flares chasing me. Oh, a zigzagoon. I don't think I have one yet. Let's be friends, zigzagoon. You beautiful cutie pie. Um, let's, uh. Scared that I'm gonna kill it if I double kick. But if I do, there's like a few. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, did you know, by the way, a lot of Pokemons are inspired to yokais from Japanese folklore. Um, a yokai is a ghost, isn't it? Uh, it's dark and normal, and it it's dark and normal in the game. Yeah. A heal ball. I guess heal balls make sense in this game. Not only ghosts, monsters and minions. Okay. Um quick attack, will that be okay? Zigzagoon is snarl. You snarly zigzagoon. Right, let's try and throw a Pokeball. I want to name a cute Pokemon if you let me. My next cute Pokemon name is on you, Savannah. Um, and Panfera, if you want to name this Zigzagoon, you are more than welcome to. Uh, it's not going to go into my thing though, I'm going to keep it in the box. So if you don't want to for that reason, that's cool. Also, uh, I'm gonna really quickly go back. I need to check something out. Won't be long. I'll watch my husband though, as I'm gone. Go. No. <laughs> don't judge me.
Ha! I'm back. Sorry. Um. Also, the Pokeball next to the HP was already cut out. Let me think. So just catch up with chat. Uh, well, it's black and white. How about Star Child? Sparks looks like stars in the eyes. Paul Stanley's nickname from Lucas. Oh, Star Child sounds good. Um. That. Uh, shooting star. It has those tinted star glasses. Shooting star would also first move in part of the overworld. Um, star. Whoops. Child. Whoops. Can't spell. Perfect. Thank you. Oops, excellently. Um, because the fur is jagged like a comet and they were really fast in the ice. Pattern the starship. Yeah, it's another nice name as well. Welcome back, thank you. Uh, glad to be back. Okay, so send to the box. Star Child has been sent to a box. Um, on a battle, huh? You saw the opening ceremony, right? Then you know why I'm excited and want to battle. You are challenged by Last Ray. Whole picks. Where did you fucking get a whole picks from already, yo? Um, just salty because I want one. I want the Alolan one though. I I've seen Obstagoon resembles too much a musician from the. Yeah. Maybe it's the point. Look at that. Vulpix Painter. So I thought it would fit pretty well. No, that's fine, that's fine. Um, I, I, I like people to choose names uh, for their own reasons. So like some people will choose it because it looks like or resembles something so it makes sense. Some people choose it because the name just literally suits them uh, because it's cute and it kind of works for them. Um, so I, I just like to have all these different names because people are so like beautiful and colourful with their naming process. Hi hey, woman! Let's... Uh, welcome back! Also if you found one, can I name uh, Solosis Jello? Solosis is the first phone of Radiclus. I do remember that. Then it goes into Duosis, is it? I think so. Um, if I find one, or oh, you know what, if you tell me where it is, um, I can try harder to find one. <laughs> uh, you were challenged by Schoolgirl Hannah. Cute. Hand jump! Oh, I want to hand jump so badly. Look at it! So determined! I have one. I have a free star one in uh, Pokemon uh, Go. That's about it though. Why did he run away? Was he scared? Oh, I should not have done that. I should have just got my Pokemon. Okay, that works. Critical hit. I think that's what helped me. <laughs> right. Well, I just got a bear scare, Joe. Uh, forget an old move. On to Tada! Right. What? I lost my Pokemon serving as women. Sorry, friend. Right. Travel if I have six of queen. All is well. We got a pen down. Um I have to name this one something particular because I promised to name one after someone. Oh, what can I name it? Oh, now I feel really bad. Um, hey, uh, 
promise, I promise the pen to someone else. That's the only thing. Yeah, I'm sorry. You, 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 you can have the next cute one. It doesn't evolve into anything cute though. Pan champs just a brutal fight. I go. Didn't think you'd want to. Next one. Next one is definitely yours. Um. Scared it's gonna critical and I'm gonna kill it. You know what? Fuck it, YOLO. Oops, save for Pangaroo. Okay. 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 even have people <laughs> um i don't believe him i bet he's very um self-conscious about that um your pokemon game experience hot vanillite growth to level 13 right pancham's data will be added to the pokedex would you like to give pancham a nickname yes uh he doesn't even know people's just black stare don't be rude don't be rude don't be rude very rude. I love him nonetheless. Uh, so this one's called Flopty. Where do you want to send Flopty to? He's gonna be part of my party uh, and he is going to replace... Unfortunately Arcanon is not part of my dream team. Uh, maybe for this is a fighting type. Power is too obvious, and Flopty is a name of someone that really likes um, this particular poke. Am I going the wrong way? Yes. Will I ever learn which way is the right way? Nope. Uh, I want to battle you, trainer. So I fought Kung Fu Panda. Kung Fu Panda is a Oh. Okay, my bad. I'll forgive you. Um, Alright, let's use ammo on this. I like Pangoro to just get it. Pangoro is great. Um, like, legit, Pangoro is great. Uh, there's some really cool cards of Pangoro. I think Pangoro doesn't get enough love though for cards. Honestly, that poke has so much potential. Um, upsets me that there's nothing big. Oh, instead of a Pokemon, I found a trainer. I'll have to check how strong you are. That probably healed my poke, shouldn't I? Schoolboy Marvin! And for you. Aww, that's what they're called. For you. Yeah. Oh, I almost feel bad. Yeah, Pikachu has like three different cards. Um, you mean for like... Pikachu has a lot more than 30 cards. Pikachu has all the promo cards, just to let you know. Um, like the... I mean, Pikachu is obviously going to be an obvious one that gets a lot of cards because it's a mascot. Uh, the same way Eevee has a lot recently because they have been forcing Eevee to be the secondary mascot uh, ever since um, they gave it new evolution. Um, ooh, Gardevoir! Hello, hello! How are you? I'm so um, happy to see you. How are you today? I think I already asked that. I'm so sorry. Not slept much. Um, I I assume you are a fellow Pokemon uh, gamer. Uh, um, would you say that Gardevoir is your favourite, or is it just one that you respect enough to have a name after it? Gossy Fleur. Uh, fight! Quick attack! Use the quick attack! 
I'm fainted. Sorry, Gossy Fleur, not today, friend. Not today. <clears throat> Yowch, your Pokemon are way too strong. Sorry, friend. I remember the guard of our Pokemon from Mystery Dungeon for Team or GBA. I don't remember that one, unfortunately. But I do have a guard of art in my po in um, Pogo. And I do love it. Oh, hiya, gym challenger. You looked real lace out there during the opening ceremony. Oh, but where's Hop? Um, oh, I know. Let me tell you about something a bit interesting. You see that building over there? It's a company owned by Chairman Rose. Just past Route 3, there's a mine where they dig up ore. That building over processes it into energy. In other words, the chairman is responsible for providing the Gala region with its energy too. Can't say I really get him, but the chairman seems like a pretty brilliant guy, right? Here, a little something for having a chinwa with me. Chinwag with me, sorry. It's an escape probe. Uh, it's an old game still with 2D sprites. You decided the game you have to complete a personality test. And due to the result, the game was assigned to you a different Pokemon to play with. Oh, that's cool. I do like that. <coughs> I feel like I tried to cheat to make sure I get the Pokemon I want to. I am that kind of a person. Like, I do it the first time to see what Pokemon I'm actually supposed to get. Uh, but then I just Google the results. Obviously, back then there was no Google, but there was probably like a, in like a magazine, there was probably like a cheat way of doing it. I got Bulbasaur. Oh, I love Venusaur. Venusaur is so lovely. Um, I'm turning with honesty to it, yeah. <gasps> Run at me. No, you didn't. I forget your name. Roly Coley. Yeah, I didn't remember your name at all. Alright, let's fight it. I need to uh, put in my Pokédex, so... I should stop using the whole case tonight. Die! It's down. Super effective. Bulbasaur, for example, is clearly a plant-inspired Pokémon. I mean, I want to catch one, so I'm just gonna... Um... <gasps> yes! Is it Clank? Yeah, 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 yeah! I love Clank! Uh, Bulbasaur is a Bulb plus Lizard. Ivysaur is Ivy plus Lizard. Yeah, 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 yeah! yeah. I, I just love them. Venusaur is Venus. Lizard. Like a Venus trap, right? Um, what can I do this so I don't one shot it? Oh, that did nothing. That also did nothing. Yeah, I know they're not very effective. I'm gonna capture it now. Get into my Pokeball! <gasps> Yay! All oh, well. Now the Broly Coley. Venus in this case stays for the Venus flytrap. Yay! <laughs> Does anybody want to name Clink?
Oh. Maybe I have a non-English name for it. Ro Rotella. Yes. What does that mean? Whoops. Rotella. All as well. Where do you want to send a Rotella to? It's going into the box, unfortunately. I have absolutely no use for it. Uh, Rotella in my language is a small name. Um, if you don't mind me asking, what is your language? Because that sounds beautiful. When you get a cute dark type, I want to name it. Well... I'm hoping to get you a cute type soon, Savannah. My main language is Italian. That's cool. And um, do you live in Italy or have you moved to somewhere else? put you in my party, I wanted to put you in my box. Right. Let's carry on moving first. Postman Tad. Looks at like Tad Harry. Why is this? Oh, it's Deli Bird! I love Deli Bird! Stupid bird. Sally Bird, you beautiful son of a bitch. Well, here's a postman, a nice choice of Deli Bird for him. It is a bit nice, isn't it? <laughs> uh, Alright, um, circle throwing is fighting. The flop team. Turns out I was carrying your victory. Damn right you were, Grant. Right. Am I like... Cute. This woman just gave me a berry. Most people just want to fight me. Got a berry from this woman. A cherry berry. Thank you. Go on, child. Let's have a battle to death. Every Pokemon's got a type of two, and every type has a strong point and weak point. You're not wrong. Schoolboy Peter. <clears throat> Let's go, lad. Sizzly Pee. Oh, I can't take it seriously. Right. 
Hate that name. Um, um I'm just gonna keep double kicking it. Um <clears throat> not doing a whole lot though, is it? So <clears throat> So, um, gonna have a skip for a bit skip, and I'm gonna have a blue kick. Um, oh shit, um, I'm usually better at this, but I'm ill right now, so it's not gonna work. Um, ada ada! That'll do, right. Um, okay, so you have another poke. Please say you don't have another poke. You do have another poke. Um, keep her Pokemon. So let me just uh, heal up, friend. Bag. Potion. Use this item on the flare. Struggle bug. It's not very effective. That's fine. Uh, let's uh, end them. I don't think that's gonna do anything now. Okay, that did a lot more than I thought it would. Light screen, so... Special moves. Uh, if I do a quick attack... That's normal as heck. Ah, oh, so close. Confusion. Uh, Loki wanna just like... <clears throat> yep, I did it. <coughs> oh no. I don't have any more water. That's upsetting. Two bottles in five hours? Okay. <sighs> A flag grew to level 19. A flame charge. Um <clears throat> Right. I think that's fine. Ugh. I'm weak to people older than me. <laughs> Sorry. Um, that was funny. Uh, these are just roly polies I already have. It was super potion. That's lovely, did we? Okay. It's a woman. She wanna fight? Me and my little sister have set ourselves as, as po a Pokemon Center services. Galar mine is pretty rough on a team, isn't it? I'll heal up your Pokemon for you, friend. Oh, it's so lovely. <clears throat> Two defenses. Nice, 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 nice. Okay. So. Uh, I hate myself because I have to catch everything. Blair fell in love. Uh, there's still Nurse Joy in the new Pokemon titles. I don't think it's Nurse Joy anymore. Or at least they changed her visual too much for it to look like Nurse Joy. <clears throat> Let's see if I can catch this. Right. Gotcha. Woo bat was caught. Oh, 
Um, Savannah, would you like to name a woo bat? That's kind of cute. Uh, I do remember she and Officer Jenny had some clowns around the Pokemon world. Maybe they're all twin sisters. Uh, they're all cousins, apparently, from what I've seen in the anime. Name Luna. Okay, we'll name it Luna. Whoops. How did I even go from... But it's kind of weird, they own the same name, all of them. It's just... What is? I mean, it is weird, but... They're all running a family business at the end of it, right? So... A wild Diglett. A fluffy fat ragdoll cat. My cat is named for you know she's a... Hmm, that's cute. Um, do you have any pictures? You should join my Discord so you can show me pictures of your uh, cat. I like to see all animals, so if anyone has any uh anyone has any animals, I am more than willing more than happy to uh <laughs> Um Okay, so Diglett's data will be added to the Pokédex. Would you like to give Diglett a nickname? Anybody want to name a Diglett? I have her as a profile picture in Shadow Light's Discord. Oh, you're from Shadow Light! But I can send more pics. I am always more than happy to look at pictures of your animal. Um, like, I have a channel full, I have a whole thing for it because... Woofy woofy animals are important. I myself can only have a hamster in my current house, so, uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, I discovered you from there. Oh, that's cool! I appreciate that. Um, right, we're not naming this one then, I guess. Oh, Chica. Oh. You're literally like this much too late. Next Diglett, I see I'm gonna catch and I'm gonna name it Chica, just for you. Work a key. Bog and roller. Oh, I'm flying. I know you can do it. Right, fight. Uh, double kick? Looks like we weren't in sync. Sorry, friend. I no, I don't think you were. Right. Oh wait. Did I pick up that item? Yeah. Is there anything else here? I hate myself because I need to make sure that I've been through everywhere. Three great balls. Great. This music is so good. Alright. Let me fight you, woman. Uh, I sent you the picture of my fluffy ball. That sounds so weird. I love that. Oh my goodness, what a beautiful cutie pie! Wow! Oh, definitely deserve the name Luna. Oh my god. That is the cutest cat I've seen all week. Don't at me. Wow. 
Uh, yeah, I recognize this sounded weird at the end, so that's why I specified on my cat. <laughs> I mean, um... Um... Yep. <laughs> uh, Fly used Ember. You'd think that Ember would be really good on Timber. But I guess not. I'm gonna use Flame Charge, I don't think I've used that late yet. She's a 13 year old cat. Coming to her old age. Um, that's amazing. 13 years and still going. That's incredible. I'm happy for you that you have such a lovely uh, I own her from 2008. <clears throat> Your cat is as old as my um my British um like I don't know. I've been in Britain for thirteen years. <laughs> so thirteen? No, sorry, I lied. Friends doing that. I think I was in here for forty years. So yeah, um, I've been in Britain for almost as long as you owned your cat. Oh my god, how many pokes do you have? Why are they all timber? <laughs> Aren't you in Britain anymore? I am in Britain right now, yes. I've been living there for... Oh, uh, sorry, I'm here for uh, a while now. I'm not planning on moving back to where I'm actually from um, because um, because no alright Scary face. Stained Hawk 67, how are you today? Thank you so much for the follow. Are you a fellow Pokemon master? Uh, ah, Timber! Don't have one yet. <laughs> Anyone want to name this one? Maybe a simple name. Woody. <laughs> you literally... Literally the same idea. Uh, doing awesome. I am so happy for you. What have you been up to today? Uh, and what brings you to the channel? Are you just looking for someone to watch? Uh, play? Or have you found me through other means? Die. Die means great. Alright, we'll do Timber the Die. Die the Timber. Um, would you like to give Timber a nickname? Yes. Die. Beautiful. I like that. <laughs> it's a nice name. He's going to a box though. He is not the champ I want in my dream team. Uh, come on, woman. Where is Sandra? Diglett. Diglett, 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 Diglett. I don't really have a lot of them. Alright. I plan on getting a Switch next week and want to free game before then. That's understandable. Uh, 
Are you getting just the regular switch or are you getting uh, a specific switch? Uh, you need to heal your Pokemon is pretty to see a solo. I do this a lot. You either get stressed or you and uh, I do this a lot. <laughs> it's just how I am, unfortunately. I apologize. <laughs> I know I need to keep them healthier, but um, I just forget to. Um, and what games are you going to play on Switch? First three games you want to complete when you get it. Please tell me. I was looking around for items, but I found a trainer. Well, I found you too, friend. Worker of a soul. Shouldn't you be working? Not looking for items. Um. I'm sorry, friend. Alrighty, it's time for me to dream right now. That is perfectly fine. I really appreciate you being here. Thank you for the follow and thank you for staying for so long. Um, I hope you have a fantastic day and I'm going to catch you for the time. Uh, it was very nice to meet you. See you next time. Bye! <laughs> Um, okay. We need to keep going this way. See you next time. Take care, everyone. Oh, that's lovely. Um. This guy just has a superiority for complex, doesn't he? Suppose I should prove beyond the doubt just how pathetic you and how strong I am. Shut up. You would challenge my Pokemon trainer better. That's his name. BD Bad Gidder. Don't remember his name. But he's got a Solosis. Uh, I'm just gonna flame charge into it. Oh, does he have it whether you play one or the other version? Because you're not supposed to have this champ in this game. This is a shield, the uh, sword one. Favorite. No. Oh, Hatterene. It's final evolution, is it? I think. So good. Uh, Switch Vision 2 on Smash. Uh, I want Sword, Zelda, Breath of the Wild, and Super Smash Bros. Okay, those are some good choices of games. Uh, personally, never played a Zelda game. You never played a Zelda game? What? Yes, that is correct. I'm very sorry. Uh, once again, I've not had a Nintendo console until I was 19. Um, 
So yeah. Uh, sword. Why do you want sword and not shield? Uh, sorry, just the, just like uh, genuinely want to know what makes you choose one, not the other. Uh, not like a mean thing to ask. But we're just like a mean thing to ask. Uh, yeah. Well, I see. Well, that's fine. I was already trying it all that way anyway. Alright, whatever. <sighs> Loser. Wait, no, wrong way. Chat can't see it properly. Naturally, I'll remember your battle style and strategies now. I'm sure to easily defeat you if and when we face each other in an official match. Now that we've established that, I won't waste any more time on you. I've already gathered my own missions out in this place. Damn. Bag of Stardust. <laughs> um. I'm doing special training while camping to train my Pokemon. The finishing touch will be a battle with you. Uh, do you recommend Shield or the Sword? So it's a personal thing. It's just for a bunch of pokes. It's practically it, really. I was going to have Sword first because they have the Gothic Lapitas and stuff. Uh, but then as I got more into Pokemon, I, I, I love this. Is it? This is a Galarian one, isn't it? What a beautiful meow. Absolute fucking cutie. Um, so I ended up picking Shield uh, only because in Shield you could have a Galarian Ponyta, and Galarian Ponyta has become kind of like a quite an important poke to me over like the last m month or two. Um, so yeah, that was that was my choice basically. Um, and then I forced my um, partner to play through Sword. They are currently doing it. If you want to watch them, I would strongly recommend. They're not live right now, but they do stream um, quite a bit. Recently been playing more Unite than anything. There you go. Um, <laughs> hey, level 21 on Flare. I have only just started this today, basically. Uh, I think he started uh, Sword. Like, I think he's done one or two streams on Sword now. Um. <laughs> Butterfree? Oh, hello, Butterfree. You are so funny. I'm sorry that I am flame charging literally everything in my time. I just want to get this over and done with so I can get to the gym. Five hours of gameplay and not a single gym. This is... a lot. Uh, what does this do? Oh no, that's fine. Sorry. Oh, yes. Let me capture you. <laughs> Quite a lot. <laughs> oh, that's sad. Oh, I don't like this child. Challenge by Pokey Kid Shade. Oh, he's got a Pikachu. I need to back a look at child. Just going to flame charge at it. Hopefully that will work. Thank god that works. Does he have another Pikachu?
Ooh, an electric. Um, need to like do an attack that will get it lowish. Or not too low. Is that his attack throws? Okay. Um, hoping quick attack will not do enough damage. This also says me. Maybe I'll it. I probably won't. I'm not gonna get my hopes up. But it would be lovely, so I don't have to fight it for too long. Oh! Oh, that's lovely! Thank you! I appreciate that. Whoa. Uh, low sweep. Use a Mr. Swift attack of the target slice, which lowers the target speed. Uses let's. See, uh, lose a flurry of open pump on first. Target is thrown and a different Pokemon is struck out in the wild. This ends a battle against a single Pokemon. Right, don't want that. What a big belly. Alright, no nickname for now. Alright, let's um let's fight this big person. Breeder Bradley. Electro. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Oh, this is annoying. The one time the paralyzer actually does something, it's gonna do it every fight, so I need to, um... Paralyze heal, use this item. I will literally just flame charge at you. Oh my god! Hi, Savannah. <laughs> okay. I just got a shiny some noise. Oh my god, that's amazing! That's so good! Nice! How'd you do that? Let's uh, flame charge. Right, ah, okay. <laughs> that makes sense. I'm happy for you, though, that's good. Hey, Pokemon Breeder Bradley. Well, I didn't raise them for 50 years. Uh, I'll trade them with random people. Let's try. Nice, um, sharp beak. Right. There's the Eevee child. Oh, 
clearly crashed into you and stopped. Are you okay? You took that tackle head on. Oh, you must be one of the gym challengers. Ah, uh, I thought so. So you're the opening ceremony. My name is Milo. I'm a gym leader and I'm rather partial to grass type Pokemon. I've been itching to see just how good the champion and those gym challengers are. Let me find out at the gym stadium. Just head on through this way and you'll run it right into my stadium. <coughs> see you there. Come on back to the stadium with you too. We gotta keep the gym challenges right in. <laughs> this Wooloo is mad. Right. But that means we're getting there. I'm just gonna run through these because I'm literally too like to a field. Hop, da da da. I don't want to go there. I need to go to the Pokemon thing. Level 100! Oh my god, Savannah! Not bad, not bad. Right. Just go to the stadium and we'll do the gym leader and then I'll do everything else on my next stream. Oh, I hate how this game forces you to do side bits before you do the main bit. Thanks, Yampa. I had you come because I wanted to hear what you thought. So, the geoglyph, what do you think of it? Animax. Seems likely. It certainly looks like a gigantic Pokemon. I suppose people 300,000 years ago could have just imagined this, but it looks too similar to Dynamax. It can't just be a coincidence. A long time ago, a great black storm covered the Gala region. Gen Pokemon went rampant, but what was that black storm called? The Darkest Day? What connection does it have to Dynamax? Guess I'm the lucky lady who will be looking into that. Grand sure gives me a lot to do. Thanks for your thoughts on the matter. Uh, Thanks, I'll give you a leak card. Who the fuck is Milo? Milo's a grass type gym leader. I just met him, didn't I? <laughs> uh, things will go well for you if you use fire flying or bug type Pokemon. Take these two, it'd be pretty bad if your Pokemon weren't in fighting form. Go on then, get yourself to Turfield Stadium and battle yourself, silly. Thanks, love. Free attacks. Woo! Let's take a look at this Nabu. It's the Grass Gym Badge and got it. I reckon I'm just about the greatest. Uh, I've had plenty of practice at it after all. I'm sure you can win this one too, after all you're my rival. Oh, can I talk to the ball guy again? Yeah, you got another Pokeball. Oh, a friend ball! Oh, thank you. Ah, oh, that's cute. Thank you. Right, do I have to...
Um. Okay. Yes. Okay. Then let the gym mission begin. Give it your best shot. Woo! We'll get there, guys. We'll get there. Welcome, Jim Challenger. Sorry, but I'll have to send you packing. It's my job. Jim Trainer Samuel sent out Gossy Flair. Go on, Flair. I know you can do it. Mm. Yeah, I will literally just flame charge into it. Woo! It's super effective. The Gossy Flair fainted. Sorry, friend. As expected. This guy's just happy to lose, isn't he? back for those ones. Hello, woman. <laughs> Notice me. Jim trying to Leah. Sounds sweet. Oh. Yeah, I will just charge it up. I know it's very unimaginative, but this is my first gym. I don't have to try, do I? Uh, keep current Pokemon on this. Hi, on this. I want me to fight you. What blind? Right. 
It looks like a little farmer boy. I like it. Right. My gym's the first one people face, so we get a lot of challenges. That's why I tried to keep the gym mission challenging, but that didn't stop you from competing at Nebu. Proper job. Sure seems like you understand Pokemon. Uh, this is going to be a doozy of a battle. I'll have to dynamax my Pokemon if I want to win. You are challenged for Jim Leadermaster. Ready for? Not like this though. Yeah, well, let's just keep the fire going. Ow.
you defeated Jim Lee the Milo. The power of grass is water. It's an incredible gym. Oh, schnitzel! Mal, hello! Oh, that, oh, that feels so bad. Because I was going to do the gym challenge and then I was going to raid you. <laughs> oh my god, thank you so much for the raid. It means the world. How are you today? Um... <laughs> <laughs> Literally mal raid type. Oh my god. Hey, what was you playing? Monster Hunter Generations Ultimate. That's cool. That was the game. Yeah, it was good. Oh man. Oh, like I just said, I was literally going to raid you because I was like, I'm gonna finish this gym and then I'm gonna go off. But yeah, um, fantastic and fun pain. Oh man. Uh, did you just start? I assume so. Um, and I mean, as long as you're enjoying it, that's that's all that matters, right? Too bad I was here first. I appreciate you. Um, so, uh, to those of you that are new, hello. Uh, how are you all? I hope you all had a lovely um, stream from Mal. I'm sure you did. He's a lovely individual. Um, I am a variety streamer, so to say. I am currently very much obsessed with Pokemon, however, so... Um, yeah. <laughs> um, and you know what? Uh, since you're here, what I'll do is uh, not only will I play for a little bit longer, but I'll also do a cheeky little booster opening. Um, that's right, I have some Pokemon cards that can be opened. <laughs> um, okay, so let me just finish this interaction with Milo and then I'll open it. Uh, it's nerd time, yeah, we get nerdy in here. Uh, so I just got my first badge after five hours of gameplay. I finally got my first badge, guys. It's taken a while. I don't know if I'm really slow or if this game is meant to be like this. Right, that's it. We did it. Right, we got a magical leaf. Cool. You did it faster than Ash, at least. Kappa. Um, yeah, no, it doesn't take much to do things better or faster than Ash, so. <laughs> right, let's change to this. I'm gonna open this beautiful booster pack. Um, just to let you know, this is the Shining Fates pack. Um, they contain shinies in them. I actually got two pretty nice uh, shinies already. So these are the shiny holographics um, that you can get. Unfortunately, those are not the two that I wanted. I feel like I will never get the two that I wanted. Uh, but they're still good, good cards, I'm not gonna cry about it. Um, too much. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, let's dig in. Um, today I learned you have tats. I've had tats since I remember. Uh, no, I've had tats for a while though. And I am getting more in October, so there'll be more noticeable as well because I'll have a whole lot then. Right, sorry, uh, I shouldn't be doing this on stream. Uh, I'm gonna try and move the top card though so that you guys can't see it because that reveals whether I've got good cards or not. Uh, one, two, three. Oh my god, I'm not saying this right. Two at the bottom. Top one will be a psychic energy? Question mark? I think so. Um, anyway, uh, you better show them off when you do. I will because they will have Pokemon. So <laughs> Oops, I'm doing this the wrong way. Um, this is a Dartrix Hoot Hoot um, Evolution. Quite a cool little boy, although his eyes are closed, I think. Uh, it's a nice little um, art style of this, I won't lie. Um, I do like this card a little bit. Right, then our second card. We've got Ball Guy. I fucking love Ball Guy. Every time you talk to a Ball Guy, he gives you a Pokeball. He's the best. He's got a buff but daddy body as well. Oof. <laughs> um, then we have a Cramorant. Um, don't really know what to say about him. He's just chilling in water. That's, that's about it, though. He's a cool bean, though. Um, then we have a Shinx. Um, will this focus? Will this focus? Shinx, my boy. Shinx, a good boy, isn't he? <laughs> He's a cutie pie and a half. Um, then we've got Rowlet, which is Dracot. That tricks is um, pre-evolution, I guess is the word to say it. It's a cool little leg, I think. Baby Owl. Baby Owl, yes. <laughs> then we've got Eevee, which I still don't know if they are swimming for their life or if they are swimming because they want to, but 
you decide. <laughs> uh, then we've got ah the hamster, cute little uh, more peco. I do like it. It's chilling with Snubble and that fucking fucking bird that I keep forgetting the name of, even though it's literally everywhere in this game. Um, looks like Pikachu. Uh, yeah, very much is a Pikachu because it's electric as well. Um, then we've got Buizel. He's just chilling or looking for anyone that he can potentially save because he's a good boy. Look at that split tail. That's a nice split tail. Beautiful. Um, then I think it's the reverse holographic type. So the reverse is a Floatzel. So the reverses have like cool, um, fuck, what's it called? Um, energy type as a pattern in the background and they are like shiny, not shiny, holographic. The music is very fitting. <laughs> the Pokemon music slaps, honestly. Uh, this is a nice card though, I'm glad I got it. And our last one is... Nothing. Dreadnought. Uh, this is that turtle's um, evolution. I'm not a fan of it. Tudal, there we go, that's his name. Um, Rose Bernard. Not burning any cards. Uh, Floatzel will get a nice little sleeve though. And he will chill on my retrieve file. You put TM10 in your bag's TM pocket. I've got a magical leaf. That's cool. Um, you can't burn a water Pokemon. That's a fact. That is a fact, Mal. So, okay. Mal is gonna come and talk to me. Tell me all about his life woes. <laughs> Some advice for you, Nebu. The gym challenge has a set order you'll need to follow. So that means you next up should be in Holbury to meet Nessa. Nessa's a mummy. <laughs> Holbury's just beyond Route 5. Or since you've got the grass badge, you could head to the wild area. It's a bit tricky to catch Pokemon that are higher level than the Pokemon on your team, but they make powerful allies if you succeed. So I am actually going to go back. Um, fight up a couple famous robot because I did miss out on some uh, lucky fights because I was trying to rush to get to the badge. <laughs> so uh, we'll fight these EV kids. We'll catch some diglets. Okay, now I say a wild pokey kid appeared. <laughs> Uh, you were challenged by Pokey Kid Sunny. Sunny's an absolute cute kid though, look at it. Uh, oh, and it has a milsery. I really need a milsery. So, yeah. Uh, Mal, how, how is your stream though? Like, honestly, how, how I, like, the stream itself, not just the game. I wanna know. Milsery needs to speak then. Lovely, just be. I hope you had a good one, and I hope things are alright for you. I'm sorry I didn't raid you in time. <laughs> I feel so bad about that. Um, right. Oh, it's already over. My stream was a stream, it went pretty well. I had a really cool friend of mine show up and no problem. Hey, I'm glad you had a friend show up. Um, um I hope they were as... Um, supportive as someone can be. Um, I'm gonna fight it a little bit before I. I'm, gonna, I'm, I'm glad I got to ride you first today. <laughs> um, well, so basically, in about an hour, we have work drinks, so I can't stay for too long because they're my leaving drinks because uh, I finally found a new job. Um, so we're going to have a few drinks at work, uh, and I'm really ill so I don't want to go in the first place right, but um, I guess I have to, at least for a little bit. Uh, that's fine, I hope you can pass the torch to someone else. I know, I'm definitely raiding, don't worry, I will definitely raid, spread the love in it. Uh, that's what I'm about. Um, but I'm just saying I unfortunately can't stay for far too long. As much as I'd love to. Oh fuck, 10 hour Pokemon stream, when? Um, I actually feel like I could do one of these because I've been going on for like 5 hours and... 
not bored yet. <laughs> 10. Yeah, I'll do 10 hours sometime. That's the promise. 12 hours. Uh, okay. I'll do 12 hours for the rest of my life. I'd have to start earlier though, because like I fall asleep quite quickly. So 10 hours is fine because 10 hours if I start at 11 means it's 9 o'clock for me. 9 o'clock is like an hour after my bedtime. <laughs> uh, if you ever find the time, please play through Black and White. You know, I've had a lot of people tell me to play through some of the older games and now I'm going to tell you that I actually intend to um, play through what I the current gen games, as in everything on Switch, and then once I'm done with the remaster of Diamond and Pearl, um, I will be playing through, um, I'll be going back so that I can play through, uh, like, the starting, like, do them all in order. Um, obviously I'm not going to play every edition of every game, I'm just going to, for example, the Sun and Moon, but there's also, also Sun and Moon for Moon, I'm just going to stick to the ultras. Um, and I'm also, well, the Ultra, because I'm not going to play for both Sun and Moon, I'll just use one of them. I'm not sure which one yet. <laughs> uh, so, yeah. Um, but that, that will probably be through an emulator, so I need to find an emulator uh, somewhere sometime. Wouldn't be nice. Right. Where is Milsery in this fucking game, yo? This kid had one with me, we could probably get it. <coughs> right, let's get this revival herb. My favourite Pokemon games are Black and White and Black and White 2. Right, but more importantly, I'm an Eevee, I'm full of possibilities, yeah, so. Um, if what are your favourite pokes though? You don't, that's a tricky one, but yeah. Uh, How's your stream been going? It had to refresh and go higher than that. No, it's okay. So my stream has been going pretty damn well, thank you. I've had amazing support from people and I have also um This is a good game, this is a game I really enjoy. So I am um, definitely uh like I don't know, everything's positive today, right? Everything's fine, everything's good. Nothing's going wrong, nothing's like, you know, scary or anything like that, so... <laughs> uh, <clears throat> I've been lucky to get a lovely raid today, um, off a of cute bean. Uh, um, man, sorry. I forgot, Z I think not that Xena is the name. Yeah, absolutely lovely, um... Decided to spread some love to me as well, so I was going to pass the love on to you, but I didn't. <laughs> um, but yeah, we've just been we've just been chilling, man. Honestly, this entire game has just been a chill upon chill. Um, this this game is just it doesn't require much. Lurkers be lurking. Lurkers do be lurking, and I appreciate that they're here uh, and they are loved by me, just so they know. Um, it's super effective. Yum, has faded. This music. Pokemon has amazing music. <clears throat> I need to battle this Pikachu child. Um, I like that they remixed the After Battle song and not straight up replaced it. Uh, they haven't done a whole lot to it, but it's still a still a good one. Still a good one. Still a impressive. Well, I don't know how to explain it. Um, I like the Ember.
Uh, there we go. Some experience points. Poke Kid Race is about to send a grubbin. We are still going to battle with this beautiful boy. Uh, I feel like this poke will be with me until I die. Uh, fight. Ember. I'm sorry, Grubbin. I'm gonna think, where can you get a Milsery in this game? I feel like it was Route 4. Let me check. Uh, Milsery is Route 4, 20% chance to encounter. Okay. So I need to go to Route 4. I don't think I have you, so let me capture you. Ah, it's a pumpkin boo! That's good about it. Right, um, this is gonna die. Don't know why I used that. Please don't die. Damn. That wasn't very good. Right. Uh, nope. Nope. Oh, what did I run into? I can literally one shot you though. Rude. What do you mean, rude? It's super effective. 82. Right. <gasps> oh, this is evolving! <gasps> Look at my cutie! I'm actually really happy. I love Gloom. Right. Was road four. We're on road five right now, so I need to. This is road four. So somewhere here I can find the milsery. Four percent chance of scoring. It's an electrode. That's a yumper. This is a peekaboo. Pumpkaboo. My bad. Right, um, I have to use something on it. Please don't kill it. This really upset me. This is my second time I fucked up. Oh, I can just throw the Pokeball, can't I? Not very smart, am I? Why am I playing this game? Right, it's an electrike. There's an early turn. I'm back! Welcome back, Savannah! How you doing? How's it been trading pokes with poops? Uh, I don't know what this is. Another Galarian meow. Uh. Um. Right, let's just use Ember on it. Let's get it out of here. There. Okay. Um, should an old move be replaced and forgotten with agility? Keep old move. Thunder Wave. 
not a fan of things that paralyze me. Um, right, quick attack. Woo! All is well, all is well, guys. Da 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 Where can I find that milsery? Posture check? Why are you gonna be mean? You always do this to me. I always have to sit up and up her. Like a human being. Unbelievable. <laughs> right. No comfort here. Precisely. Right. All I see is yampers and electrics. This upsets me. I was hoping to get a cheeky milky in the last five minutes. But I may not have the opportunity. Is that a Galarian Meowth again? <gasps> it's a fucking Wooloo! <laughs> I already have one. I'm just going to fight it, but let's go. That's cute. I do like Galvantula. But I don't know if I want it to be fair. I should have just caught it if I wanted it. You know I'm just gonna catch it because of boys. I'm gonna end up being paralyzed till I die. Step on it! What kind of sick pervert are you? Bag, paralyze heal, use this item. It's a spider. Yeah, it's a spider. Uh, fight. Um. Okay, so and that was my chance to capture it, really. Spiders deserve step. No, they don't. Spiders are lovely. Spiders help us so much. They eat all the disgusting bugs that you don't even know about because you don't see them. Spiders are cool. Right. What a joltic. I'm gonna give it a nickname. And I'm gonna name it Mal, and that's it. Just make webs for me to walk into. They don't eat the brown moths in my room. Maybe they don't like the brown moths. Have you ever thought about that? You're just trying to force it onto them. Great, so I'm a spider now. That's right, you're a spider. Name Sparky. <laughs> that would be a better name. But we're here to teach Mal a lesson. Spiders are useful and lovely. Not some horrible creatures. They like key things. Ooh, there's an item here. An energy root. I hope I die. <laughs> what? Come on, bro, that's a bit far. Right. We have fought with everyone we could without like progressing too far into the game. Uh, we've done a swing of everything we could. We have caught all the items that we could. Um, I think this calls for a cheeky Poke Center and and save. Uh, we are on a six-hour mark now. Six-hour stream of Pokemon. 
can't believe how long some of you have lasted. Mainly charming them. Um, so yeah, let's uh, rest my pokes. And then let's save the game. And then we shall raid someone. Someone who deserves a raid. Someone who I haven't raided in a while. Um, let me see who's online whilst I do all this jibber jabber. Um, not really a whole lot of people I look on right now. So, we are going to... Oh, okay. I know. Take me to a grass dungeon. Um, no. I hope to see you again, right? I hope to save this game because I forget to save a lot. Save your progress. He saved your progress. Um. Hello? There we go. Do you want to see my League card? Not League of Legends card. On this route, you can capture a UV. Okay. Thank you for telling me that because I do need one. <laughs> Look at my capture card. Uh, not my capture card. Jesus Christ. Look at my league card. It's so cute. <laughs> um, but yeah. Uh, I would like to say a couple of things before I disappear. Um, first of all, thank you so fucking much to uh, so many people. I'll start the list off by not that, that Xena by giving me my first raid. Uh, a few hours ago that was mighty lovely of you and i hope to catch you later um thank you to panther for sitting here for hours don't know how you did that mate honestly i'm just just impressed <laughs> uh thank you mal for your beautiful raid as well i really appreciate that I'm so angry that i didn't get the chance to raid you you made me play this game for longer how dare you <laughs> no, i'm joking um and massive thank you to Gardevoir, uh, RoboGamer, Masoke, uh, literally everyone that's been here. Boomstick has been here for ages as well. A lone Wolf, all your bits. Honestly, I wouldn't be here without you guys. Uh, without further ado, uh, we will be raiding. Um, fuck. I mean, uh, not fuck. Uh, Forgotten. -er. Uh, this, uh, uh, we will. Oh no, that's not the right one. Oh, that's fine. It's fine. It didn't work. Um, we will be raiding a dear mate of mine. Um, they are currently playing Don't Starve uh, with Fathom and Meru, who are their friends. I don't know why I decided to include that in there. Uh, but yeah, uh, they are absolutely lovely, wholesome, and. Uh, just all in all a good individual being. Um, they're not the best at video games sometimes. Sometimes they do make me question their life. Uh, but that's what's funny, right? Uh, that wasn't very nice. Anyway, um, I'm going to shut up and I'm going to raid him now. Thank you everyone for being here. Thank you for uh, letting me open my Pokemon cards in front of you all. Uh, and I hope to see you next time. And when that is, I will let you know via Discords. Bye, lovelies. Bye, YouTube. <laughs>